Hey, good evening, everybody. Welcome back. Primetime Tuesday. Tuesday. Wow, it is Tuesday, isn't it? Hey, everybody. What's up? What's up? Metal Dave back with you, folks. Uh, still recovering from my weekend there. Um, ah, man. Great weekend, though. Great weekend in Indianapolis. Man, oh, man, what a day that was. History in the making. Uh, something we might not see for a number of years again. But then again, we might see something even more exciting within the next couple of years. Uh, but uh, guys, I've got a killer show for you tonight. Uh, we found some stuff we thought was lost. I've got a few really unique pieces, uh, one really super unique surprise for you guys tonight. Uh, let's just say it's numbered one of only 25. And that's all, I'm gonna leave it right there for now, folks, because we're gonna get this show started, and that happens right now. slap on now I'm gonna to have to try to fix that before we get going here plus I need to turn my other monitor on here real quick all right ladies and gentlemen how is everybody doing out there my goodness gracious folks I'm glad to be back but yet I'm not glad to be back uh, I know that's kind of a confusing statement but uh, I tell you when I get when I get back up uh, back up home uh, it's harder and harder for me to come back afterwards uh, it was a great weekend up there at Indianapolis, folks. As you know, Helio Castro Neves captured his fourth, only the fourth driver in Indy history to win four Indy 500s. Uh, and, that, and that was 30 years since the last time it happened. Uh, but I'll tell you what, don't be surprised if in the next two to three years, Helio becomes the first five-time winner of the Indy 500. That man has no signs of slowing down and he did it with an underfunded team this year. So think about that one for a second. That says a lot for his talent, his skill, and his ability to race that track there at Indy. Man, oh man, oh man. And he's been, you know, he what finished, he's been, you know, he's had so many second place finishes. He could have had seven or eight of these by now. So uh, don't be surprised if we don't see him capture number five within the next couple of years here, as long as he stays healthy. And I'm pretty sure he has no signs of slowing down there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, real quick, let's get these rules going here. First and foremost, you do need to be 18 years of age or older to bid. Secondly, we need you to first register at diecasttv.com. Quick and easy process there. Um, all we need, we just need to verify a couple pieces of information. Then you pop back in here on Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, and uh, right there in the comment section is how you place your bids. Uh, we do have to have everybody registered. As you know, we are a licensed auction facility, so everybody does have to be registered. Uh, let's see, shipping, dollar a car. Um, in the U.S., if you spend, U.S., Puerto Rico, Hawaii, $50 in a broadcast day, which is 11p to 11p Monday through Sunday. You're gonna grab free shipping. Internationally, we build boxes. We have deals in place upwards of 75 to 80% off of actual shipping rates. So we save you a lot of money there, folks, and get that out to you. All right, folks, now as you know, we do have H boxes in, and I've got a few of those. We're gonna do a few things with those tonight. Also, also, uh, I've got a few other pieces here this evening, folks, that you've seen a few times, but, 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 something a little bit different about them. All right, uh, there's some deals to be had, so I want you to stay tuned with me there tonight. Let's see, Daddy Magic, hey, how you doing, buddy? Man, I've been praying, buddy. I heard uh, I was in on the show a little bit this afternoon there, my friend, uh, praying that your, your daughter uh, gets to come home soon there. I know it's got to be a scary time right now, buddy, but just keep faith, my friend. Stay strong. She's going to need you. For sure there, buddy. Uh, Ronald is asking, do we buy them? Yes, sir, we do. Uh, I'll tell you, uh, Ronald, the easiest way to do that is to private me message us at diecasttv.com and uh, then uh, you'll uh, get, get uh, message Ross the Boss. We call him Ross the Boss. You just send a message to Ross at Diecast TV. Uh, Ross does the majority of our buying, so there you go, buddy. There you go, Orlando. That's it, my friend. That's it. That's it. All right. So, yeah, just uh, send a message to Ross there, and uh, we do buy collections. Uh, so, um, if anybody, you know, and uh, we've got, we can do it. We can do it one of two. We can do it a couple different ways. So, just get a hold of us there, or we buy Hot Wheels 
www.mainlines.com. Two easiest places to get a hold of us there. Oh, do main lines? Do we got main lines? Dude, do I got main lines? Trust me. Trust me, trust me, trust me. I tell you, we're gonna do a we're gonna do a lot of different things this evening. I've got some really good high-end stuff tonight, folks, that you can have for a lot less than what you think. Well, with the exception of maybe one really super cool piece. Um, and let me ask you guys something. Who anybody know who Brian Pope is? Anybody does that name ring a bell with anybody? Uh, I don't know if Mike Young or uh, Boss Mopar or uh, Bad Timmy or Fallon or if any of you guys are out there. Anybody know who Brian Pope is? I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. P-O-P-E, I'm pretty sure that's Pope. It's either Pope or Poopy. I don't think it's Poopy. So, <laughs> I don't know, does that name ring a bell to any of you guys and gals out there? Hmm. Not. So far I've only seen, I see Facebook and YouTube. Anybody out there in Twitch land? I see all my all my things are lit up saying that we're all locked and loaded and good to go there. Is anybody out there on Twitch? What's up, my friends? What's up? So far, I've only had comments come in from Facebook and YouTube. Hmm. I don't know. Well, anyway, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'll save that question here for a little bit as we let things, as we let things kind of, kind of, you know, let everything kind of percolate and... Uh, we'll let all the gang get in here and we'll get going folks. I'll start you out. We'll go over here We'll have a nice little we'll start out with some loose a little bit of loose here, too I have loose ones here for you tonight. Nice little three dollar loose right there. What the heck do we got there? I believe we have a Camaro check that out three dollar loose there three dollar loose Hmm, excuse me goodness uh, I will tell you I will tell you folks Oh man I tell you, it does take me a few days to um, recover. Uh, my location, there was safety at Indy right there. If you've seen the video I posted when I went live of the start of the race, you've seen how close I were to those cars as they are flying by. Literally, I could reach out and touch them if I wanted to lose my arm, of course. But uh, man, the, uh, the, ex the, the, the exhaust, the, the, tired, the tired dust and all that stuff, man, it just it clogs me up big time. And needless to say, I'm a little, rough, a little rough in the voice today, but it'll get better over the next couple days. So we got a nice little loose one there, folks. Check that one out. Now, guys, I am going to go through the backyard. We'll start out going through the backyard first and foremost. Uh, I do have H cases. Uh, I may throw, uh, I might, just might throw dice. We may, uh, we might run a, we could do a box break. Heck, I'll even do last man standings. I want to see how many of these boxes we can get out tonight, folks, all right? And I'll highlight cards from those. I'll, I'll pull cards at random from other boxes here. We'll put stuff up here. I've got a Batman bundle, it looks like. I don't know how many cards are in there. I'll count those as we go. I'll let you jump up front. Let's jump up front here, folks, all right? <coughs> Excuse me. A couple things, a couple things of interest. Now, I know you've seen these plenty of times, folks, but... I'll tell you what, here's, here's, here's the funny thing, all right, something completely off the wall and different here tonight. I want you to take a look, number 8,116 of 1,000. Now this, of course, is the Golf Raptor, the Hot Wheels RLC Golf Raptor. You've seen it was numbered there. Check that one out, folks. <laughs> all right, now, as you, uh, let, me take, let me take those rules down. Those have been up there long enough. All right. Now here's the deal, my friends. Here is the here is the deal. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you guys some deals tonight. Some really solid prices here, folks. I'm telling you right now. Uh, you know, I'm always in a good mood when I get back from Indy. So let's just see how much of a good mood we can get going here tonight, folks. Because you know, this thing was up here at well over three hundred dollars, right? Well, now think about this for a second, my friends. Just think about this for a second here. All right, one eighty-five is where is my price on that one tonight. One hundred and eighty-five for the Golf Raptor, for the numbered RLC Golf Raptor. Looking for one eighty-five on that one tonight, folks. One hundred and eighty-five bones in the basket will get that one. That's a potential last man standing in and of itself, right there. Well within reason on that one but wait it gets better well i don't i don't want to say it gets better but let's just say it gets good it just kind of gets good 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 and good all right because my friends i'll tell you what 
I'll tell you what here, I've got a couple other good pieces here tonight, ones that you have seen in the past. And uh, I know, you know, you guys kind of were like, well, no, not really. <laughs> if you wanted to do that, I got, I got one also for this. Well, no, I don't know, guys. I think I'm more competitive here this evening. I'm a little more than competitive, all right? Now, check this out. Now, you've seen this one plenty of times. Now, this is the one that's off the blister, as you can see. It is the Texas Drive-Em. Check it out. This is the Pittsburgh Convention one. It is off the blister. Now, you know, this thing off the blister, that, looking for 300 on that one, right? I was looking for 300. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. All right. This thing is worth about four to five hundred dollars, completely carded. Loose, it runs right around two hundred. Somebody want to start me at one fifty? Yeah, that's kind of where I'm, kind of where I'm at tonight on that. All right. Think about that. Think about that. Think about that. Speaking of Texas drivers, here is the RLC one, uh, number two thousand two hundred and seventy-seven of nine thousand. All right here, folks, check it out, check it out. There's your RLC one right there. That one's pretty doggone cool there, folks. Uh, and it is off the blister as well, as you can see. Uh, this one would be about 150 to 200 um, current market value, but off the blister, 75 bucks, folks, $75. That's a killer cool one right there. That is all, that is the Chrome one, folks. That's not the, it's not the, uh, you know, that's not the other one there. That's not the other one there. Show car, what's up, buddy? What's up? Here you go, folks. Insane deal, insane deal right there, folks. $75 will get you that one. Now, here, here's a one good on the card, number 1,476 of only 2,600. Right there. Crazy cool, right? Check it out, check it out. This is your Los Angeles uh, convention, Texas Drive'em. Right there, right there, man, oh man, oh man. Check that out, check that out. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm still trying to get tired, tired. Uh, that, uh, uh, that crap out of my, out of my respiratory system there. Woo wait, here we go, folks. Texas Drive'em, right there. 125, ladies and gentlemen. 125 bones in the basket to get that one started. So there you go, my friends. Now you wanna talk about some cool deals right there. I've got them and I've got 125 on the bid right off the bat, bad tees like, oh hell, dude. I mean, oh heck, man, oh heck, oh heck, 125. Heck, I'm all over that. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I got 125 to start the night here. All right, let's see if I can figure out how to work this board. I've been gone too long. Here we go, here we go, here we go. 125 on the bid here, folks. The Texas drive them. This is the good one on the card. Good and solid there. Cody Collins, what's up, buddy? Cody, I seen you. I seen you got that super away from Rick there today. That was a good, that's a good man. That is a good one there, let me tell you. And I'll tell you what, I was a, I did have just a little bit of downtime, so I went to a big flea market in Edinburgh, Indiana. Uh, which is just about 30 minutes from Indy. And uh, there were five different vendors in there. Five different vendors in there, folks. And I gotta get this to 125. I gotta concentrate on what I'm doing and shut my mouth for a second. Uh, but there were five different vendors in there that uh, did Hot Wheels. And each one of them had one or two of the Bluebird, of, the, of that Super, all right? They wanted over $225 or more for them. So uh, what, what, what it went for today was an absolute steal. Absolute steal. Um, craziness, craziness, craziness. I just couldn't bring myself, uh, I couldn't just bring myself to spend that kind of money on it though. I, uh, yeah, all right guys, so here we go, here we go. Check it out. Here's the deal, 125 on the bid. Absolute beauty here. Absolute beauty here, Kabin, Kabang, Kapow, clock is hot, and here we go. I got a 125 on the bid, 125 on the bid. Bad T all over this one. 125, 125, 125. I'll tell you what, man, I, my, I'm hoping I can find one on a peg because, hi, yi, yi. I think that's one super I'll never be able to afford, but chances of finding it on the peg in this area are slim. 
Yeah, get it and sit on it. Exactly. Exactly. Oh, man. Here we go, folks. We got 18 seconds left. Bad Timmy's got the deal right now. 125, 125. And I'll tell you what, folks. The weekend was kind of long, as you know, and we are about to say that this is going to be sold, sold, sold. We start out the night. Hey, Pick. Hello, hello. All righty. Good deal there. Good deal there. Boom is right. Boom is right. Cool beans, cool beans, cool beans. <coughs> Dang it. Ah. Good night, Nelly. All right, folks. All right. So now I asked a question a little bit ago. If anybody knew who Brian Pope well, is. I don't know a whole lot about the gentleman other than knowing that he makes some pretty dadgum cool customs. And they're usually very, very, very limited. Very, very limited. This one is Brian of PopesDesigns.com. B-R-Y-A-N. Uh, guys, I want to show you something. I want to show you something. I want to show you something. First and foremost, you know, they individually number, they individually number each piece. I want you to look at something. This one is number one of 25. All right. Not number two, not number three. This is actually number one of 25. Now I want you to check this out, ladies and gentlemen. You want to see something absolutely killer cool, killer crazy? Check it out, folks. Holy Picasaurus there, folks. This is Pope's Designs. This is the Bojangles Quick Chicken Pickin' uh, 2020 Charlotte, North Carolina Nationals Gasser. Gasser. Thank you, Lance. Lane, how you doing, buddy? Lance, how's it going? Check it out, folks. Holy cow, you want to talk about a hot piece? <laughs> Check that out. Man, oh man, oh man. That is one killer gasser, gasser, gasser. Man, only 25 of them made to begin with. And there you have it, folks. That one right there, that is the crazy, cool, killer Right there, holy pick, holy pick, holy pick. Check that turkey out. Man, is that not cool or what? Man, oh man, man. Got some other good ones too. Got a couple other things, other things too here. Now this is probably the priciest thing I have in the backyard tonight. I will tell you guys up front, that's gonna be the priciest piece in the backyard. All right, I do have a few others. Do you have a few others like, uh, like this one right here. Looks like we have the Legends Tour Team Transport. Check it out, folks. There you go. The 2021 20, Legends Tour Team Transport. It does have the Wally World logo on it there. So, you know, I, yeah, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but check it out, folks. Pretty cool piece there. That one's pretty slick. There's your Legends Tour Team Transporter. Pretty sweet little ride. Man, man that's kind of cool. Kind of cool, kind of cool. We'll set that one off to the side here because we do have that little stinker. I got a couple other goodies, a couple other goodies too. Here we go, folks. I have the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. This is a 2018 collector's edition. Check that one out there, folks. That one's pretty sweet. Not numbered, mail in, nice piece. And we also, of course, have the, uh, uh, just a little 59 Cadillac funny car. Is I don't know, you know, 59 Caddy, it's a hearse on wheels, right? It's a hearse with a revved up engine. 
and goes down the track, you know, runs that quarter mile or eighth mile, whatever, whatever particular one it feels like running at the time. And there you go, another beauty, another stinker of a beauty right there. So check that out. It's a couple, there's some really cool pieces right there. Really nice ones in the backyard there. Ah, we do have some lead sleds. I had no idea, you know, for the longest time, for the longest time, guys, I had no clue what we were talking about on these lead sleds. Uh, you know, people ask me, you got lead sleds? You got lead sleds? I was, I thought they were probably some sort of little low riding contraption, but little did I know they were these hot puppies right here. Daryl Gardner says 15 on the Bel Air. Uh, sir, uh, while well, I wholly appreciate that bid, uh, we're, we're way up, we're off base there, buddy. We're off base. Ross has that marked at 40. He has that one marked at 40 on the start on that Bel Air gasser. On the mail in Bel Air. Oh man, oh man. Here we go, folks. We got some nice little lead sleds. Killer little lead sleds here. Check it out, check it out, check it out, folks. Holy Picasaurus now. That's a really cool little set there. I think Rick was looking for 30 on that one this afternoon. I think he was, I think he was looking for that right around there. Uh, let's see. So let's see, so Daryl's like, ah, he kind of chuckled a little bit, and then he says 42. Do you, you mean 40 there? Um, you mean 40, correct? Let, let's jump back here a second. Let's jump back here a second. I don't want you over, over bidding the start right there. I want you going over on that there. 40 is the start. If that's where you're at, buddy, we'll get this thing up and clocked and out the door here pretty quick. All right, guys, here we go, 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 bang, 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 pow. All right. Now, guys, I do have H cases, H cases, Woo. I know you guys, I think you guys, I think you guys had some fun with them over the weekend. Um, I think, what was it, what was it, what was it, what was it? Ha, ha, ha. You're just going to have to guess at that. You're going to have to take a little bit of a guess on that one, guys. It's, it's going to, it's, it's a, uh, let's just put it this way. It's north of three Picasauruses. Here we go, folks. Here we go. I got 40 on the bid here, 40 on the bid here, 40 on the bid there. On the hearse, on that uh, that caddy, that caddy dragster, it, um, uh, I believe that's also was a 2014 mail-in piece, right uh, on that one. And uh, Ross has got that one tagged at 30 to start on that one. That is sold, sold, sold. Here we go. All right, so Daryl grabs a nice one. That's a nice one right there. That's a cool deal. Cool, 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 cool. You know, now there's something a little bit different about this one. And I think this is what might have made it. This might have been part of, maybe I should have showed this first on the back. Maybe I should have showed it on the back because it's got all the Chinese writing, Thai, Taiwanese, Japanese, uh, whatever language is on the back there, as you can see. So I think this one might be just a little bit different than your normal everyday one. Dang it, I should have probably showed that right up front. Right at first. Oh, well. Oh, well, oh, well, oh, well. Uh, so let me show you that hearse. The, the caddy right there. There you go. There you go. Why is that camera up high again? I like to set them right here because it focuses in better. Hang on. Let's do a little. There we go. There it is, much better, much better. So there you go, folks. There it is. Sit right there. It's a little little dragster. 2014 collector's edition on the Hot Wheels. It's a beauty. It's a beauty. It is a beauty. There you go, folks. There you go. Never give you a better look at that one. I don't like taking things out of protectos, but sometimes you just about have no choice just to show it off. Now, folks, 30 will get you going on that one. 30 will get you going on that one, folks. 
Only one of 25 on that little beauty right there. Man, that's a killer, killer, killer piece there. So check that stinker out. All right, guys. All right, as you know, as you know, as you know, as you know, we have right here in my hand, I am holding H case, factory sealed H case. Now check it out, folks. Now I've got three different ways I'm gonna do this tonight. All right, we, last man standing, 15 spots, $10 a spot. $15, $10 spots. Um, wait a minute, 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 hang on, hold the phone, and back up just a cotton pick in a second here. Fifteen eight dollar spots. Fifteen eight dollar spots. And what I will do is I will pull also the prize cards are coming from an H box. Alright? So we'll last man stand. We could do a box break. That can be a little a little time consuming. Or I will wind up throwing dice maybe a little bit later tonight as well. A little bit later tonight as well. Uh yeah, 35, not even close not even close if you're talking about that pope custom nope not 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 quite not quite not quite not quite bad timmy six seven and eight got you buddy six seven and eight here we go folks here we go here we go here we go here we go man oh man oh man check it out my friends here we go so we'll do a last man standing there all right, we'll work on that. We will definitely work on that, folks. I do have a, I believe this is the Deco Rally Cult Racer set, I think is what it was called. I don't remember correct, exactly on this, folks, but it is a five-car set, and it's a pretty cool five-car set. It's a super cool five-car set. Check it out. Stretch out with the Ford Focus. I mentioned that it was a little over three Picasauruses. Only number one of 25. Very, very rarely do you get have in your hands the first one of anything made, especially when it comes to really limited pieces like that. There's your Ford Focus. We have the Nissan Skyline 2000 Turbo RS. Number three in this set is the Volkswagen Golf MK2. Then we have the 88 Honda CRX. That's number four. Number five in the set is a little, uh, little pink uh, Scion FR-S. So there we go, folks. Now this is one crazy five-car set. One crazy cool little five-car set here. Check it out, folks. Check it out and check it out. Holy crazy Picasauruses here, ladies and gentlemen. Whoops. All right, I'll set it there. All right, guys, let's see if the wide shot will pick this up. I don't know here exactly. All right, take a look, take a look, take a look, take a look. Hey, Hack, what's up, man? What's up, what's up, what's up? All right, guys, I'm going to back this out just a hair. There you go. All five of these beauties. It is the set, one through five. Um, I'll tell you what here, guys. Tell you what, tell you what, tell you what, tell you what here, guys. 15 to start this. 15 to start this. That's $3 a car here. Three bucks a car, five car set. Very interesting little, very interesting little thing here. Very interesting. You know, you got your, you got your Nissan Skyline. You got a Honda CRX in there. You, of course, then there's the Scion, the Focus, and the VW Golf. So, you know, that's five pretty cool little castings. Right there. What do you say? What do you say here, guys? How about a bid? How about a bid? How about a bid? How about a bid? How about it here, folks? What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Uh, Lance, last man standing, a factory sealed H-Box, which has the Mustang Funny Car as the treasure hunt, and it has the 71 Dotson 510 the Super T Hunt, 
possibility of one or both in that box. I have no idea because it is factory sealed. You have a very good, you know, you have a shot of pulling something good out of that because there's lots of good cars in that one. We're doing 15 $8 spots on that one. Right now I have six, seven, and eight taken. Those spots are taken on that one. All right, guys, here we go, here we go. What do you say, what do you say, what do you say here? Somebody wanna fire up 15 on this set? That's three bucks a car here. Three bucks a car, crazy good. Crazy good stuff there, crazy good stuff. Hack is going to take two, three, and nine. All righty. And I will be pulling cars. I will be pulling cars from a factory sealed or from a, yeah, from an H case as well. So there you go, there you go, and there you go. So here we go, folks. All right, I got 15 on the bid here, 15 on the bid, 15 on the bid. Let me kill her that, we said it. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. 15 on the bid, 15 on the bid. Let's get it, get it, get it. Bad T's got it right now for 15, 15, 15, 15. Here we go, 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 here we go. 15 on the bid, check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. 15 on the bid, 15 on the bid. 15 on the bid. How much is the Oscar Mayer Wiener will be worth? It just depends. It just depends on what somebody is willing to pay generally. We start minimum bids here at $5 unless it's something really super special like treasure hunt, super treasure hunt, or really limited edition pieces. If it's the if it's the old version, uh, it may start out at around 10, but there again, it, it falls to whatever somebody is, uh, uh, you know, whatever somebody is actually willing to pay for that. You just have to collect, catch the collectors at the right time. And that is sold, sold, sold. Bad Timmy grabs that set. Nice, nice, nice. I do have a second set. I do have a second set if anybody wants it. If anybody wants it there, a bad tea. If you want, if you want two sets there, let me know, buddy. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. I've got two of them. Two of them there. All right, guys. All right. So how about that? How about it? How about it? Let's see. Christopher Tucker says 12, 13, and 14. Got gotcha, you, buddy. All right, so we're getting closer there. We have number one, four, five, 10, 11, and 15 available. And we'll last man stand that one. We'll get that one going. Like I said, prize cars will also be coming out of that case. So you've got, you know, who knows what's gonna come out of that. I don't even know what's gonna come out of that because I will, I will pull blindly. If you guys have watched me do, do these LMSs before, I always do a blind pull. Uh, you know, I turn, I don't, so I don't see what I'm pulling. You know, so if it's something really super cool, hey, you get what you get there. Wayne says number one and four. Got you, buddy. All right, got you, got you, got you. All right, so that takes us down to five, 10, 11, and 15. 5, 10, 11, 15. Ooh, we're getting closer, 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 closer. Speaking of cool pieces in the H box, guys, check this one out. This one's kind of neat. It's the Mercedes Benz 500E. That's a pretty slick little ride right there. That one's kind of cool. I think there's a pretty cool Honda in that box too, if I'm not mistaken, right? If I remember correctly. There's a good one right there, folks. What do you say? How about a bid there? How about a bid? How about a bid? How about a bid? How about a bid? Who'd bid? He'd bid. He'd bid. He'd bid. He'd bid. He'd bid. He'd bid. Ba 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 ba. Exactly what I just said. I tried to say or mumbled, mumbled, jumbled, jumbled, mumbled. All right, folks. Well then, I'll tell you what. Maybe you don't like that one. Oh, how I wish this was the other one. 
But guys, here's the 71 Datsun 510. Here's your main line version of that Datsun 510 right there. That one's pretty neat there. Check that crazy critter out. You want to talk about something super cool, super cool. There you go, there you go, and there you go. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. This is one of the most talked about pieces as far as supers this year. Uh, I have, uh, you know, who would have thought it, right? Who'd have thunk it? Who'd have thunk it? I must say, the color for the super is definitely much better than the mainline color, in my own personal opinion. Alrighty guys, there you go, there you go. What do you say, how about a bid? How about a bid there? Now I don't have the super to show you. I wish I did. I wish I did, but I think you guys may have seen it this afternoon. But man, check this one out. Here's your tea hunt. Here's your Mustang, funny car, treasure hunt. Check that out. Now what's really cool is, of course it has the tea hunt symbol on the back of the car, but on top of the car, they use the Super Treasure Hunt gold <laughs> to put it on top of the car. Well, that's kind of cool. It's kind of cool, kind of neat. Uh, that's a nice one there, my friends. Nice one there. Now, I do believe, if I'm not mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, I think that one sold for $10 or something this afternoon was the starting bid on that one. So I will, ha I will have to honor that. Uh, on that one, folks. But uh, you never, like I say, you never know what's going to come out of the box when we pull cool ones out of the box, as you know. All kinds of good stuff. This box appears to be loaded. From what I understand, from what I've heard, and what I've seen here, I don't know. But uh, so we got that going. And also, guys, something else I will do. Now, for those of you that may be new. We, do, we will, from time to time, throw dice. And here's what happens there, all right? What happens there is we'll do $5 throws. All right, it's a, it's a $5 roll. We have two dice, $5 a throw. If I throw snake eyes, you win the factory sealed case. Any other, I will pull a car from an H, H case. So you're gonna be getting H case cars here uh, but uh, get the snake eyes, of course. You will, you will definitely get the. <laughs> you'll get the case. You know, we'll take the dice, we'll shake it, we'll rattle it, we'll roll it, we'll throw it in the box, and oh, looky there, looky there. See, see how easy it is. Right there, right there. Man, oh man, oh man. So check it out, there, folks. Check it out, check it out. And I did that from all the way back here. So maybe that's how I should do it. Maybe I should throw it from all the way back here at the table. Man, oh man. Anyway, guys, so check that out there. Last man standing, five, 10, 11, and 15 are the remaining numbers there. All right, and we'll get that going. Now guys, I will, um, let's see here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let me, I'll tell you, I'm just gonna grab some uh, random, some random Hot Wheels here and we'll, we'll put up, we'll, uh, we'll uh, I'll just run some like, you know, put up three or four at a time here and uh, let's see what we can do, right? All right, guys, so hey, let's get that tea hunt out of the way there. Nobody wants that Mustang tea hunter, do they? Nobody likes that one. <laughs> here we go, folks, I'll start you out. Ford Thunderbolt, this will be a one money takes all here. Ford Thunderbolt, 41 Willie's Coop, so it's kind of spooky looking, kind of cool. Neat little piece there. Here's your trim truck. Looks cool from the side, right? But man, when you switch to the overhead, it is trim. That truck's been on a diet, and that's a first edition, by the way. And then check out from the Red Line collection, the Hot Wheels Red Line. Here's your tail, oh my goodness gracious, look at this tail rider. Man, now that's not nothing. That's not nothing right there. So check that out, folks. We got four of them right here. One money takes all. How about it here? Who to bid? 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 Here, check it out. Check it out. One money takes all. You got five pretty cool little main lines. Or uh, four, I'm sorry. Four pretty cool little main liners right there. Check those out. What do you say? What do you say? 
Just looking for a little bit here to get her going. Get it going, get it flowing. Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. Hack, I'm not taking five dollars. Nope, no way, no how, uh-uh, nope, it ain't happening, it ain't hap, oh, wait a minute, it did happen, oops, <laughs> five is the bid, here we go, here we go, here we go, I got five on the bid there, folks, five is the bid, got four nice ones right there, holy cow, get them, get them, get them, what do you say, what do you say, what do you say, ooh, boxcars, hey, I'm throwing doubles, 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 all right, ooh, this is going to be a good night, I can feel it, I can feel it, I can feel it. What do you say here, folks? How about it? 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 Let's get it, get it, get it. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Go and go. Let's get it, folks. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? All right. Looks like Hack's going to take this little grouping home. All righty then. Bang, boom, pow, and boing. Sold, sold, sold. All right. Hey, it is what it is, and that's what it is. Well, let's keep this up. Let's see what other kind of goodies I can pull out of this box here. Let's see what other kind of crazy, crazy cars. I just pulled a random box in, and what comes out comes out. What goes up goes up. What sells is what sells. All right, folks, so here we go. Let's do it again. Yeah, let's do it again. Excuse me. <clears throat> let's do it again. I've got the power sander. Nice little dune buggy critter thing there. Check out the Alfa Romeo prototype, BAT9. This is a 2005 first edition from the Realistic series. That's an interesting little piece right there. That's kind of cool. Check out the White Heat series, number one of five. It is the 16 Angels. And of course, I have uh, from the Red Line series, we have the Eight Crate. Eight Crate. So check it out there, folks. Here we go again. Here we go again. Here we go again. Oh, man. Check it out. Check it out, folks. Check it out. Patrick, what's up, buddy? What's up? What's up? Here we go, folks. Four of them right there. One money takes all. Let's get them, get them, get them. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I'm just pulling from a, a box I grabbed out of the other room, and whatever comes up there pops up there. So let's get it, get it, get it there. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? How about it? 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 Who's going to throw a five at that? Anybody going to throw a five at that? Hmm. I don't know, I don't know. The red line, the eight crate from the red line one is a good one all on by itself. There. That 16 Angels is no slouch. That first slouch, but that first edition Alpha Romeo prototype. That's a kind of a cool little piece right there, guys. Definitely one to have. Definitely one there to have. I got five on the bid, and we got the clock going. We got the clock going. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Five on the bid, five on the bid. Patrick's got the deal. Patrick on the dealio, stealio, right there, right now. Here we go, here we go. Five on the bid, five on the bid. I got six. Now six, now six on the bid. Daryl Gardner comes in there with that six. Here we go, here we go. It's a nice little set of four right there. Nice little set of four in those main lines. Kind of cool, kind of neat. 16 Angels, is a, it's a nice looking casting, but man, I'll tell you what, the uh, the Red Liner 8 Crate right there is really kind of cool from the Red Line collection. Well, of course, like I said, the Alfa Romeo Prototype First Edition is definitely no slouch by any stretch of the imagination there. And here we go, folks, six on the bid, six is the bid. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Six is the bid, check it out, check it out. And we're just down to five numbers left on the last man standing. Eight dollar spots. The winner is going to take home a factory sealed H box. Here we go. Here we go. That is sold. 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 Uh, 
All right, nice grab there. All right, about time to put up a different loose one here. Let's try this nice little, oh, it's a, oh, it's a Johnny Lightning. Nice little $3 loose, $3 loose Johnny Lightning Camaro. Check that out. If you look in the back window there, I do believe it says Hot Rod. Hot Rod Magazine or something right there in the back window. Nice little piece right there, guys. Nice one there. What do you say? What do you say? How about it? How about it? How about it? $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose. Let's grab some other stuff out of here. Let's see what kind of other crazy cool goodness we got in this box. Just random goodies here. Random goodies, random goodies. Whatever comes out, comes out. Pat grabs a loose one. Toby, I've got the numbers that are left on the LMS are 5, 10, 11, and 15. Wait a minute. I can't count tonight. 5, 10, 11, and 15. Only four numbers left. Hat got in there just ahead of Patrick on the loose. Mystery Bone Shaker. That is the mystery car from the mystery pack, Bone Shaker. That's not your average everyday bone shaker. Definitely not your average everyday bone shaker there. Check it out, folks. $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose. $3 loose. Eight dollars a spot. Numbers five, ten, eleven, and fifteen. All right, guys. Meanwhile, back up front. Back up front. Let's put up four more here. Can you get five and ten? Can you get a five and ten? Huh? A five and a ten? Well, sure. Why not? Right? <laughs> All right, Toby. Got you, buddy. All right, that just leaves 11 and 15. 11 and 15, we'll have an LMS for a factory sealed box. Cool beans. Here we go, folks. Check it out from the Craze Clown series. We have the cool one, the ice cream. Ice cream. Oh, buddy. Here you go, folks. Collector number 147 from 2005. It is the 57 Cadillac Eldorado. Oh, man, check it out. There you go. How cool is that piece? Oh, 2005 First Edition Cockney Cab. Man, oh, man, oh, man. There's some interesting pieces here. Interesting pieces here. Here we go. Oh, man, and check it out. 2004 First Edition from the Bling series. It is... Something every every guy I think likes. We have a nice little Hummer here. Nice little Hummer. Check it out. Check it out. Boom, boom, boom. There you go, Hummer. Let me slide that one in the back slot right there. Get that to sit right there. And there you go. Check it out. Check it out. Man, you got that caddy. You got the Cockney cab. You got the bling Hummer. You got the ice cream cool one. It's actually four nice little pieces right there. Good stuff there, good stuff there. 11 and 15, Daddy Magic, all right. We sold out of Last Man Standing, that's one box. Definitely going somewhere tonight. That's good, that's good, I like that. Like that, like that, like that. All right, now guys, I'll tell you, and I'm gonna do this a little bit different. Instead of me picking the box, I'll set I'll set the three, I'll, I've got three, three factory sealed cases in here with me. All right, the winner will choose case one, two, or three. They're all factory sealed. All factory sealed. All right, and the winner will choose between those, all right. So we'll do that. I think that's a nice, easy way to do it there. That way, if you, if you choose the wrong case, you can't blame me for it. <laughs> That's the way I see it. All right. That's how we'll do it, guys. I think that's a good way to work that, work that out here. These are fresh off the pallet. 
I'm gonna let's see here. All right, let's see how that shows up here on camera. All right, let me click that button over here real quick. There we go, as you can see there, there you go, you got three of them right there. Ooh, I don't like that angle. Definitely don't like that angle. Let's bring that more so over here. That's a little bit better. There you go. There you go, there you go, and there you go. All right, so here we go, folks. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, uh, see, I gotta move that camera. Let me get a different loose one up here. I don't know, all these loose ones are kind of left over, but uh, here we go. Let's try this one. Try this one. There's your nice little loose one there, folks. Nice little loose. I'm going to get the bingo balls in here. We're going to get this last man standing and rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Got you on the loose one there, dude. Got you on the loose. All right. All right, folks, I'm going to get all 15 balls loaded here. Two, three, four. Let's see. Five and six. Okay. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, and 15. Woo! I can still count. All right. Let's get this organized here. All right, let me get that loose one for Orlando here. Switch it up. Let's throw up another loose one. Ooh, a little dodge, little, little Mopar, little Mopar, little Mopar in the house. Check it out, check it out. $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose. Pretty doggone good right there. All right, I'm gonna. I gotta check the cameras there. I want to flip this other bank of lights on. It'll help illuminate that a little better. All right. Here we go, folks. Here we go. Let's check these cameras. Of course, the wide shot is good. All right. Let me. Slight little adjustment. When that rolls down, I'll put a. I'll put a ball that we're not using in there. So we can see when it comes down and out. Yeah, that looks good. All right. So we're ready, I do believe. So here we go, folks. Here we go, here we go. So on the last man standing, let me read these off here. Wayne has one, Hack has two and three, Wayne has number four. Toby with five, Bad Timmy with six, seven, and eight. Hack has nine, Toby has 10. We've got, we got Daddy Magic with number 11. Chris Tucker with 12, 13, and 14, and Daddy Magic with 15. So there we go, folks. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Last man standing. Here we go. Here we go. And here we go. All right, let's do this. Let's shake it up, shake it, rattle, and roll it. First ball out. Ay, 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 number eight. Boy, number eight's usually a good number, but boy, tonight it sucks. All right, so we got bad T with the first one there. All righty. So here we go, here we go, here we go. I'm gonna reach into the box. What do we pull out here? Ooh, nice. Hey, that's, man, that's a cool one. The 2016 Ford GT race. Man. Wow, I like that. Oh, my goodness. All right, quit staring at the card, dummy. Get back to the last man standing. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Ooh. 
Number one. Number one, number one, uh, Wayne. All right. Well, let's see what we pull out of the box here, shall we? Here we go, here we go, here we go into the box. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. It's the 71510. Main, main line though, not the super darn it, but hey, cool car. Cool car, cool car. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it again, do it again, do it again, do it again. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Next ball out, number four. Four, 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 four. Oh, no way. Wayne, come on now. Man, oh man, oh man. Those things never play pretty. They never play pretty there. Here we go. Let's dig in here. What have we got? The RV there yet. The new color for the RV there yet. All right, here we go. Let's do it again, again, and again. Number five. Number five, number five, that is Toby. So here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's reach into the box. What do we got? What do we got, what do we, oh, nice. That's the Nissan R390 GTI. Kind of a, uh, I don't know if you want to call it a Grand Prix style racer or what there, but that's a pretty cool little Nissan there. Looks like it'd be good for the racetrack. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Number six, number six, number six, number six, bad teeth. All righty. And by the way, if anybody wants to purchase uh, one of these H cases, you can, they're $120 shipped. That's your shipping and handling, that's your, we pay the taxes and everything. Flat rate, $120 per case if you want one. Right in case and you got it, all right? Right in case and you have it. All right. Hey, David, what's up, buddy? What's up? Toby says to donate. All right, we will donate that one. Donate that Nissan. The children at the hospital will greatly appreciate that. All right, so here we go, folks. Here we go. I got to reach in here. Let's pull out something for bad tea. It is the 2020 Shelby GT500. It's a nice one. All right, bad Timmy pulled a couple cool cars so far. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh yeah, that, I'll tell you what. Which one? <laughs> the, the flying start or the, uh, or the one where I was at the very top of the stands right at sunrise. Now if you guys know, I, uh, I had to be there I actually, really, I had to be at the track at 3 a.m. on race day. And uh, that was crazy. But, uh, um, here, let's see here. Let me get the sound up here, guys. I'll show you my uh, my station position on race day, and just to kind of give you an idea here, just kind of give you an idea of what my what my view was of the start of the race.
Let me fast forward this a little bit. This will give you an idea if it focuses. That, that's my that's the position I usually man uh, during the race. Uh, right there. Actually, no, it was in the short shoot between one and two. The short shoot right there between one and two. The south vista of the speedway there. That's where I'm based out of. Um, and uh, whoo, it's crazy good fun. Crazy good fun right there. All right. Hey, let's get back to this LMS here. But man, I'll tell you what. When those things, the you know, at the start, they're, not, they're nowhere up to full song, as you know. It takes them about a lap. But when they come by the second time at about 230 miles an hour, you got to hold on to your hat, folks. Because, I mean, they cut punch such a big hole in that wind that it will knock you over if you're not careful. All right, guys. So here we go. Here we go. Let's get back to the LMS. All right, next ball out is number two. Number two, number two, number two. Actually, I'll tell you, I, I really like the South Vista. I really do like the South Vista there. And uh, I have to tell you, no, uh, a hack, they were various boxes. Uh, there was probably the British Horsepower. There, were, uh, there may have been a Japan Historic Three. Uh, there could have been, there could have been, a, I, I don't know, they were random. They were all, all random, random, and random. All random, random, random there. Uh, uh, there could have been a JH3 uh, box. Uh, could have been a Modern Classics, which may have been 10 of the same car. It was just, uh, I just grabbed boxes at random without even looking what they were. And we just tossed them up there. We just tossed those critters up there. All right, I gotta go back because I gotta remember number two, number two, number two. That is hack. Watch, uh, what are you talking about, dude? I missed something here. Hey, <laughs> right, yeah, yeah, what's up? I will tell. For me, that that section right there uh, that I'm stationed in, I was originally stationed in E stand in the penthouse, which is right there in turn one. You know, the photos that you see at the start of the race where they're coming to the start finish line, that's where I was stationed. That was always a pretty good spot, but man, I'll tell you, right there in the South Vista, that is just insane. It's an insane spot to be there. All right, so here we go. Let's reach into this box and pull out something crazy here. It is the arachnoid. And I said crazy, and boy, was that crazy, arachnoid. Whoops, you know what? No what, no what, no what? No, uh, I just noticed it's actually, it's actually tore. The, the blister's busted. Blister's busted, the car will slide right out. So heck, I'm gonna pull you a different one. I can't use that one, that's not good. Let's pull a different one here. Yeah, they should have, yeah, all, they should have all been real riders. Oh, score, dude. There you go. I pulled out a bad car, a bad pa a package, and here you go. You got the Bluebird. Mainline, though, darn it. But still, you got the Bluebird. Or the 510, I'm sorry, not the Bluebird. The Datsun 510, 510. Yeah, they were all, they were all real riders. Uh, I, will, I, will, I will guarantee that much. And if, you, if for some odd reason, one of them wasn't a real rider, return it, guys, all right? Make sure uh, to return it, and I'm, I will personally replace it with a box of real riders. But they should have all been real riders, yes. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. I don't know, though. Did I throw a... No, surely I didn't put a green light down on the farm box in there. If you did, somebody got a bunch of tractors. <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. I wouldn't do that to you. Wouldn't do that to you. Here we go, guys. Let's get another one here. Naughty number nine. Naughty number nine. Ah, back to back hack. Let's 
try this again. Yep. Uh, I was saying earlier, Dave, I'll tell you what, you know, it's been 30 years since we had a four-time winner in Indy, and it's only, it's only the fourth time we've had a four-time winner in Indy. So will we see another four-time winner in my lifetime? I don't know. I would like to think so. Got a couple really good young guns in there. That Brian Hurd is no slouch. You never know. You know, we'll just have to wait and see. But uh, I guarantee you, though, within the next three year, two to three years, I wouldn't be surprised if Helio doesn't get become the first five-time Indy 500 winner. Uh, let's see, Hack, we got you the Carbonator. Keep that in your pocket. You can uh, pop open your bottled drinks with that one. It wouldn't surprise me though. I'll tell you what, Helio. Whew, tell you what, that guy. I don't think he. I don't think he's ever gonna quit. I don't think he's ever gonna stop. That, he's got all the energy in the world, and there's no question he can wheel a car, especially in Indianapolis. Fourteen. Number fourteen. Number fourteen. That is Christopher Tucker. Alrighty. Here we go, folks. Here we go. Let's get down into the box here. Oh, come on. What's it? What is it? It feels hefty. It is the Pictionary Pro Stock Camaro. Alright. Go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get back to it. Back to it. Back to it. Back to it. I'm kind of looking forward to um, August when uh, they do the double header, the Xfinity series and the Indy cars on the road course in the same day. That's going to be a good. That'll be a good day. I think that's on a Saturday. Then I do believe the Cup cars. Yeah, it's it's actually two point. It's almost, it's two and a half miles actually. It's a two and a half mile track. Number three. Number three, number three, oh, number three, number three, number three. Uh, IndyCar, I, I think they used to. I don't think they do anymore though under the new schedule. And number three, that is Hack. I know, I know that Penske, Penske wants to kind of Penske wants to kind of get some more ovals on the schedule as well. I wouldn't be surprised if IndyCar next year doesn't expand their schedule a bit. All right, here we go. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? The what the heck? Eruption. Eruption. If you're if your eruption lasts more than four hours, please consult your local doctor. All right, here we go, folks. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. What? Oh my! We're getting down to it here. Down to it. Down to it. Down to the nitty gritty, to the stems and seeds, whatever you want to call it. Here. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that too. Here we go. Next ball out is number 15. Number 15. Who has number 15? That is Daddy Magic. Were there any Mopars in this H box? I don't remember. I don't know if there is or not, but let's see what comes out of here, alright? Let's see what comes out of here. The sidekick. Slide kick. Oh, that's the one. That's the one where the driver slides out of the side of the car. I think Talladega is a little too high bank for the Indy cars. I think, it, uh, but then again, I, I will say uh, several years. Well, it's been it's been a lot longer than that. Uh, here a while back, uh, they were trying to uh, set a speed record at Bristol Motor Speedway. They brought in a super bike. They brought in. Modified, they brought in a sprint car, uh, several other style cars, and they brought in an Indy car. The uh, Indy car went out to warm up and pulled right back in. Uh, on, even on its, on its warm up lap, the driver said that the, it was just too short, too high bank, and he couldn't see. So I, I don't know. Talladega, 
High banks, man, I'll tell you what. Sheesh, they would probably, they do, they were pushing 230, uh, two, almost hitting 240 down the back stretch at Indy. I can only imagine what they would turn at Talladega with the banking and not having to, you know, sheesh. I don't know. Man, oh man, oh man. That would be crazy. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's get another one here. <coughs> We have number 11, number 11, number 11. I tell you, Helio has lap, lap traffic, lap traffic to kind of thank him on that final lap because whew, if he wasn't catching a toe off that car in front of him, he might have got passed again. He might have got passed again there. Here we go, here we go, here we go. What number did I say that was? I get talking and I keep forgetting where I'm at at the time. That was number 11. That is, oh, Daddy Magic. So close is right, buddy. So close is right there. Okay, well, okay, beep it, yep. Yeah, Bristol, a little half mile, a little half mile, yeah. He, they, but uh, what, what, there was another track that they ran. What was it? Uh, out where, Iowa. You know, they used to run in Iowa. Iowa was not quite a mile track. I think like three-fourths of a mile or something. I forget what size Iowa is. And they were even having a little bit of trouble uh, with vision on out there as well. They just turned the lap so fast that, you know, I don't know. Oh, here we go. Let's dig deep here. Dig deep. And what do we got? 2017 Camaro ZL1. Little Camaro, Camaro, Camaro. All right. Let's see. That goes over here in the daddy pile. <coughs> Excuse me, all right. We got four balls left here, guys. Four balls left, and let's see what we got here. We have Bad Timmy, number seven. Number 10 is Toby. Number 12 is Chris, and number 13 is Chris. Oh my goodness gracious, so, 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 so. Here we go, here we go, holy carrots, right? <coughs> All right, good luck, guys. Here we go. And what do we got here? Ah, it's number seven. Number seven, number seven, number seven. Dad, never it, bad teeth. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. What do we got, what do we got, what do we got? It is the, the Dream Mobile. Ah, okay, yeah, the Dream Mobile. That one's kind of a weird one. But I know it, it, has, it, it, has, it, it has people that really like it though. Here we go, here we go. So, 10, 12, or 13. Number 10, number 12, or number 13 or left? Uh, here we go. Is it over on this pole, or are we going to sudden death? Let's see, shall we? Clickety clunkety clunk. We have number ten. Number ten. Number ten. Oh, that is Toby. That means we got two balls left. Number twelve and thirteen. That is Chris Tucker. Chris, you won the case, buddy. We'll verify those final two numbers here in a second. Just as soon as we pull out, I really, let's pull out something good here for Toby. Let's see what we get here, all right? Here we go, here we go, into the box. Ooh, what's this? Oh, nice. Guys, this is a really cool one. This is that new, this is that new paint on the Latroca. It's the art car, really cool. Oh, David, you gotta get to one, buddy. You gotta get to an IndyCar race on an oval, man. Road courses are cool. 
don't get me wrong, but man, on an oval, 230 mile an hour speeds, it just kind of blows your mind. All right, guys, so here we go, here we go, and here we go. We'll verify these last two numbers here. All right, we'll start with this one. Boom. Number 12. And number 13. Unlucky for some, but for tonight, number 13 was good for Chris. Chris Tucker wins the case. Right, I gotta pull Chris one out of the box here. So let's get him one out of the box here right off the bat. It is the Rock'em Sock'em Robots. Chris wants the middle case. All right, buddy, you got it, you got it, you got it. You're gonna take case number two there. Perfect, 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 perfect. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. The middle, middle case, all right. I will set this one down here for a second. We'll get this metal case. That will be on its way to Chris. Congratulations there, sir. Good deal, good deal. Man, oh man, oh man. Right off the pallet, cool bananas here. Nicely done, nicely done, nicely done. Daytona is a good, Daytona is a cool track, man. Uh, I've gone to every uh, every fall race at Daytona every since we moved down here. The cases are $120. That is shipped. No other expenses. We pay the taxes on it for you. We pay the shipping. Flat out $120. The case is yours. If you want a case, we've got a few left. If you want a case, all you got to do is grab it. Just say case, and uh, I'll mark you down for one. We'll make sure that you get one. All right, now guys, we can do another LMS on a case if you want. We could do a case break, but we eh, we wouldn't have to sell all 72 spots. Would not have to sell all 72 spots to do a case break. Uh, you know, because the house would keep, you know, the house would keep the cars that nobody else takes. Uh, if we were to do a case break though, uh, we would do them at $2 a spot. That's $2 a car one through 72 and if you were in with Rick and you've seen how the case break works you know we pop the case right here for you to see and then we pull in order from uh, from my left to right we pull three this way three that way three this way three that way blah 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 and blah 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 uh, I haven't got my ticket yet for this year David have not got my ticket yet for this year yeah Timmy will take number one through ten on the case break. And guys, you can take as many or as few spots as you want. Bad Timmy will take the first 10 on a case break. Anybody else, that's $2 a spot. Two bucks a spot there, folks, and we'll break a case. Let me do that there. I gotta get my tickets ordered. I'll, I think actually, I think prices went up on them today. But Daytona's opening for full capacity. Uh, you know, they did uh, the past, Past couple races there, they did uh, limited, limited. You know, they did spacing on the seating. Now they are opening it up completely. Bad Timmy's going to take twenty-five through thirty. The twenty-five through number thirty. All right. Hack is oh my gosh, Hack is really going to make me work here. Number twelve. Number fourteen. Number 16, number 18, number 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, and 30. <laughs> All right, so heck is going to multiple up. Well, I can give you everything up to 24, but 26, 28, and 30 are already taken by bad Timmy. So, Hack, if you want to choose three other numbers, uh, any uh, there, 26, 28, and 30 are already taken there. You want so 44 and 66. All right, 44 and 66. All right, and number 44. Gotcha, Hack. 
Got you there. Let's see. Wayne is going to take 31 through 34. All right, so 31 and 34. No, you're fine, man. You're fine. You're fine. 31 through 41 for Wayne. All right. Let's see. Patrick was going to go 32, 34, and 36, but Wayne got in there just ahead of you, Patrick. Um, let's see here. So the first 10 are taken. I have 11, 13, 15, 17, 19, 21, 23 available, 42, 43 available, 45, all the way down to 65 available, and then number 67 through 72 available on those right on those spots right there all right so there you go pat patrick says 11 13 and 15 got you buddy all right so that's 10 and 11 12 13. That's 39 spots taken there. Lent says number 21 and number 72. All right. So number 21 and number 72. Got gotcha, you, buddy. All right. Cool beans there. Cool beans there. All right, guys. We'll, we'll work this for a little bit yet. We still got plenty of time here yet. Uh, we'll, put, we'll run this. I'll, I will plan on running this uh, about nine o'clock. All right. So we'll, we'll leave this open for spots to be taken up at not then at nine o'clock. We will break it. If we the ones that we don't sell the house will keep, uh, house will keep, you know, Dave, I'm not a hundred percent sure. I think, I think last year, now the past few years, Crafty was able to get them through the hospital. So we got them at a discounted rate, but now last fall, I think I paid $100 a ticket, if I'm not mistaken, and, uh, for, for where we sit. And, and we had pretty, de pretty decent seats high up. Uh, of course, the higher up you go, the more they cost. Uh, the, Daytona has an interactive map on their ticket site. Uh, if you go to Daytona, I think it's DaytonaInternationalSpeedway.com, and uh, you can view their, their ticket prices and their seating map there. But now let's see, that's, that race is what in, uh, is that, uh, it's in August now. They moved it, it was July 4th weekend, but now I think it's, it's, the, it's the cutoff race for the chase. So that's usually a little more exciting. You got guys that do things they won't normally do at Daytona to try to get themselves into the chase there on that. I don't know, I'll have to look at, I'll have to look at that, Dave. I'll look at that and maybe I'm, I'm, I'll text you or something there on that info, message you. All right guys, so. We'll work on this box break here. We'll work on filling that. Let's get back to some other stuff going here. All right. Whew. All right, so here we go, my friends. Here we go, here we go. I'll take that set down. I'll take that set down. And here is a good one out of that case. I'll put this one up here. See if anybody's interested in this one right here. It is the Dodge Van. It is the Moon Eyes Dodge Van. That's a pretty cool one there, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. All right. Lance, the numbers left are 17, 19, 23, 42, 43, 45 through 65, and 67 through 71. That's the numbers that are left there. Check that out, my friends. Take a good look there. Excuse me just a second. I need to step out my clear my nostrils here.
Mm. Sorry about that, guys. Holy cow. Like I said, it takes a couple days for me to get that crap out of my system. Lance says he'll take 62 and uh, 44. Hack has 44 there, Lance. I'm sorry. It's uh, 42 and 43 are available. Uh, 62, I got you on that one. If you want to uh, grab one other than 44. Phew. All right. All right. So guys, let me get that one out of the way. That I've got to buy it now here for you. This will be a $5 buy it now. I have one, two, three, four, five. I have seven of these available at $5 each. At $5 each here, folks. 43 then, gotcha, Lance. All right, here we go. It is the first edition Nissan Skyline. $5 each. I have seven of these available. If you want one, claim it. You can claim as many as you want here. Claim as many as you want. Lance will take 43. All right, Toby says 45 through 50, all right. This is a $5 buy it now, guys and gals. $5 buy it now, Nissan Skyline. First edition Nissan Skyline. If anybody wants one of those, grab it, grab it, grab it. Wayne says, skyline him. All right, you got it, buddy. You got it, you got it, you got it. Skyline ya. Anybody else? Anybody else? That's a cool little skyline. That is a cool little skyline there. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Skyline, nice one. All righty, guys, let me let me run. Uh, I'll tell you what here. Yeah. We're close enough here. We'll, we'll do this box break here in just a moment. Let me run through the backyard one more time. Then, uh, then we'll do the box break. Then we'll come back. Maybe we'll throw dice for a while and see if we can give away a case that way as well. I'm all about getting some cases out of here tonight. So here we go, folks. Oops. Let me move that camera back. $5, $5 a piece on the skyline there, folks, if you want it. All you gotta do is jump on it. Grab it, grab it, grab it. All right. <clears throat> Alrighty, guys, here we go. Here, uh, let me move that cam, that's right. Put the camera back, ding dong. All right, here we go. There we go, that looks pretty good there. Let me check. <coughs> All right. So there we go. All right, so let's let's do a quick backyard run down here. Hey, skyline you. I'll skyline you. I'll give you a skyline by golly. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. Gotcha, dude. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. What's up, buddy? How's it going, man? All right. We got Wayne and the dude with the skyline. $5 a pop right there. That's a good old little skyline. And I still got one, four, I still got five of those critters left. All right, so here we go. Let's run through this backyard. I've got some deals going tonight, guys. I got the green light on some deals, as you know. The Gulf Raptor. You know, you've seen that one sitting there at around $300 or more, right? Not tonight. $185, folks. We're looking for about $185 on the Golf Raptor here. All right. You know, you know what this one is. You know what we're talking about here. The RLC Golf Raptor, $185. That's roughly about average. That's about what its average selling price is right now. 
right there, 185. You can get that. You can get that nice little Gulf Raptor there. What do you say? What do you say? Check it out, folks. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Now this is that crazy Texas Dragon, the Pittsburgh one, the Pittsburgh uh, Collectors Nationals. Now this is the one off the Pop Blister. Now you know they wanted 300 for it. Um, it at, in a perfect card, it's been in the five to six hundred dollar range. But uh, being that the blisters popped, and you could probably you could probably fix that if you wanted to. But guys, one fifty. One fifth, 150 on that one. Then of course we have the other one on the popped blister here. It is the 2016 selection RLC, the chrome one. Check that one out folks. Uh, looking for 75 on that one. For 75 on that one folks. And you can probably re-glue that. I don't want to try it, but you know, if, you, if you're if you're good at that kind of thing, by golly, you can more than likely do that. 75 will get you that one. All right. Also, also, all, oh, check it out, folks. Here's the Parnelli Jones Ford Mustang Boss 302. Guys, somebody want to give me 40 to start it? Somebody want to start me out at 40 on that one? It's the Parnelli Jones Ford Mustang, the vintage racing. That is the Canadian release there. And that one was tagged at like $115 at one time. Uh, and I think the, the, the last time we sold one, I think Rick sold it for $55. Guys, $40. Bucks, and you, got, you can probably steal it for that price. I know you'll steal it for that price. Oh, by the way, by the by, by the by, we can't, we do, I did come across one drag strip demon. All right. One drag strip demon. Now the card is just your card's got a couple issues, a couple little bins there. All right, a couple little bins there. Now check it out. Here you go. This is the little Nate Plymouth Cuda funny car. Plymouth Cuda funny car. The little Nate. Check it out, folks. Check it out. Card's not perfect. All right. I'm just telling you guys up front so you know what you're looking at here. Um, Somebody start me at 10. Start me at 10. Start me at 10. If this card was if this card was perfect, guys, I would be asking at least 20 to 25 for this one. But the card, the card's got a couple dings to it right there. So uh, and there you go, there you go. I got 10 on the bid here. 10 on the bid, 10 on the bid, 10 on the bid. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. Let's get it, get it, get it. Drag strip demon, beauty, drag strip demon. Cool little drag strip demon there. Now guys, I do have some spots left on the case break. Available numbers are 17, 19, 23, 51 through 61, 63 through 65, 67 through 71. But as soon as I get through this backyard tour here, guys, we are going to, we're gonna break the box. We will break the box. You can also purchase a box outright, 120. That's taxes and everything, all we take care of that. 120 is what you'll pay. You got, and that's free shipping, of course, as you know. Confederate Cat checking in, what's up, buddy? What's up, what's up? Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Bad Timmy's gonna take this one. All righty, sold, sold, sold. Good grab there on that one. Good grab on that one. All right. Let's see here. Let's work on this backyard a little bit more there. Um, on the, uh, you're talking this one, the one with the pop blister. This one right here, bad tea. If that's the one you're referring to, I would do. I would do that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Here we go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I got sixty on the bid here, folks. That is the RLC Chrome Texas Drive'em. Sixty dollar. I got a sixty dollar offer here. Sixty dollar offer. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out, kaboom, kabang, kapow, boom, here we go. 60 on the bid, 60 on the bid. Now it is off the blister, as you know. 
But even at that, even at that loose, I've seen this loose at 70, 75, 80 bucks. So 60 is a good deal here. You're gonna get it with the card and the, the you know, it's gonna come exactly the way it is here. What you do with it after you get it, eh, it doesn't, I don't know. Whatever you do with it after me, I don't care, <laughs> you know? That's up to you, up to you. It's a good piece though. Good piece here, good piece. Check it out, check it out. And here we go, 60 on the bid. Bad Timmy, got the deal here. Got the deal here on that one. That one is cool, 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 cool. Nice one there, nice one there, nice one there. Bad Timmy's gonna take it. Holy cow, what a deal. What a deal, what a deal, what a deal, what a deal. Cool beans there, that's a good one, good one, good one. All right guys, let's look through this backyard a little bit. <clears throat> a little bit more here. All right, what else do I have sneaking around back here? Here is the TNT bird. This is another uh, RLC release. The TNT bird, as you can, you know, you know the unpunched card. It is numbered 1,090 of 5,000. All right. Now it is, uh, if it'll focus, come on. Oh, well, anyway. Here we go, folks. Now it's got a $60 tag on it. It does have a $60 tag, but who, who to bid 40? Who to give me 40 to start? 40 to start that one. Who to give me a 40 to start that one? That one right there. Well, matter of fact, I'll make it a winner's choice because I also have the King Cuda. The King Cuda. Check it out. Check it out. I'll make it a winner's choice. We'll make it a winner's choice on those two right there. And I got 40 on the bid. 40 on the bid here. 40 on the bid. 40 on the bid. Check it. Oops. Hang on here. Boom, boom, boom. Here we go. Here we go. 40 on the bid. Let's go, go, go. Wayne says, oh, heck yeah. I'll do 40 on a winner's choice. These are cool cars. Cool cars, cool cars. Here we go, here we go. And there we go, and boom. 40 is the bid, let's do it. I got 40 on the bid, 40 on the bid, 40 on the bid. We got a 40, 40, 40, 40, 40K. 40, 40K, here we go. Wayne's got the deal. Wayne's got the deal, he's got the steal there. Some good cars, good cars. Good stuff to choose from on that one. Lots of good stuff there to choose from. Lots of good ones to choose from there. All right, beauty, beauty and beauty. All right, 40 on the bid, two seconds left, one and sold, sold, sold. All righty there, Wayne, what you gonna grab, buddy? He can take one, he can take both. He can, whatever he wants here, winner's choice. He's got it. He's got it here. I think what was I think the TNT bird was the first one I put up there, and I think that's the one he was bidding on. But uh, we'll give him a second. He's on Facebook. Bit of a lag there on Facebook. But let's see. Let's see. Let's see. TNT bird, you got it, you got it. Anybody want to grab the King Cuda? 40 bucks, folks. $40, $40. Anybody want to grab that King Cuda? Now, uh, anybody that was in here on the afternoon show, uh, did Rick mention something about some, some cool stuff coming in? He didn't say anything to me this evening, and of course, we really didn't get to talk a whole lot. He was on the phone when I got here, but uh, here we go, folks. Anybody for the CUDA? 
Anybody for the cuda, 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 cuda? All right, Let, let's continue on with a few other pieces here yet. Then we're gonna move on over to that box break. I do have the Legends Tour Highway Hauler, Team Transport, Legends Tour. Check it out there, that's a beauty. That's the Walmart, the Legends Tour piece right there. Check that one out. Uh, let's see, that looks like it's got a Picasaurus on it there. Looks like they've got a Picasaurus on the start for that one. I really don't know a whole lot about this Legends Tour stuff. I never, I never tuned in on the program, mainly because I was here working every time. Every time, every time. Yeah, Confederate, I've got another one in the works here. I've got, I've got a few numbers left. I do have a few numbers left on that one. Uh, I'm gonna throw, I'll, I'll even throw dice, so we, and we may, if we have time, we might even try to do another Last Man Standing on one. Here we go, folks. So there's that, if anybody's interested in that one. I'll set that little beauty right there for you to kind of gander at the rest of the evening. A couple other pieces here, then we'll move over to the box break. All righty, all right. Oh, give me a second, guys. I just got a message that I do have to view real quick. In the meantime, let me put this up here, folks. Here, here it is. This is the, this is that really cool, uh, Cadillac funny car, the mail-in caddy funny car. I do need 30 to start that one though. I do need a 30 to start that one. All right, guys, so there's that little stinker right there. That's a pretty cool one, that Caddy Funny car in the mail-in on that one. All right, actually, let me sit this one, slide this one back over here. All right, I do have, oh, check it out, folks. Hot Wheels, Justice League, Batmobile. Real rider tires, beautiful little piece here, guys. Check it out, check it out. Let me give you the wide shot on this one, folks. Now. You know, these usually go for around 20 to 25. Usually with these kind of, yeah, I confer, what I have left are the following numbers, buddy. 17, 19, 23, 42, 51 through 61, 63, 64, 65, 67 through 71 are the ones we have left. I don't have to completely fill it. I am going to run it here in just a couple minutes. I'm going to do I'm going to do the box break. The house will just keep the other ones. No biggie there, right? No biggie there. Uh, you never know. You just never know what's going to come out of these boxes. That's what I love about these box breaks. What do you say here, guys? Somebody want to start me out at 10 on this one? 10 on the Justice League Batmobile? That's, that's really light. That's light to be starting that at, but I'm going to start it there if anybody wants to go on. 10 on that one, what do you say, what do you say, what do you say? Who'd bid 10, who'd bid 10? Lance will take, uh, what? You lost me there, Lance. You're gonna take number 69, got you, buddy. All right, so that's, that's putting the numbers a little, uh, there we go, we're getting there. Getting there, getting there, getting there. All right, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Nobody for that one. All right, a couple other pieces I have here yet. Oh, check this out. I didn't see this one. The 69 Ford F-350 ramp truck and the Ford Mustang Boss 302. Greeny. Green Machine Chase and the HD truck. Man, now that is cool. That is cool. That is cool. Man, I actually like that. That's pretty sweet there. Pretty sweet there. Uh, I was told to sell, sell, sell. So I know what it was priced at, but guys, $40 to start that. I'll start that one at 40. I know they wanted a bit more than that for it, but 40 will get you this greenie. That's a killer, killer setup there. 
Man, I'm a Mustang Boss 302. Look at that. That's some serious green machine stuff there. All right, guys. Now, I, I showed you this one earlier this afternoon. This is the Pope design. Check it out. Let me get you the close-up on this one. Let's get you the close-up on this one. This ain't nothing. <clears throat> this one ain't nothing, folks. Uh, just to give you an idea, there's only 25 of these made. Only 25 of these made, and they are individually numbered. And look at this one. Number one of 25. This is the first one off the line, folks. First one off the line. Brian at PopesDesigns.com. This is the Brian Pope Bojangles Gasser. Bojangles Gasser here. Check this thing out. This thing is as sweet as it gets. Check it out. Check it out. Holy pick. I've seen, I will say, I've seen some of these pieces. Not this particular one, but other ones put out by Pope Designs, by this gentleman in particular, that have sold for four, five, six hundred dollars. And they're and very limited print runs. Very, you know, limited print runs, 25. I've seen some that were numbered up to 50, and I've seen some that there were only five of. This one is number one of 25. All right, so you've got the chance to get the first one, first one off the line there. Now, we are looking for a little over three Picasauruses here on this one. You know, it, it's, got, it's got a pretty high price. It's got a high, kind of a high stone on it, but for what it is, and to be only one, the first one, I think it, I, this is just too cool to believe. Too cool to believe on this killer custom piece. The Bojangles, chicken picking. This is from the Charlotte Nationals of tw the 2020 Charlotte Nationals. You know, the Nationals that never were. And here it is. Check it out, folks. That is just too cool, too sweet to believe. So take a good look right there. Take a good look right there on that one. All right, so here's what we're gonna do, folks. Here is what we are going to do. We're gonna get ready to run, do this box break here. We are gonna get ready to run the box break. What I'm gonna do is, guys, I'm gonna put, uh, this will be the last call for numbers. I'm gonna start the clock. When the clock hits zero, we will do the box break. So if you wanna grab random numbers or whatever, just call it out. These are $2 a spot, $2 a spot here. All right, guys, I'm starting the clock. When it hits zero, we're gonna break the box. I have it right here, as you can see, factory sealed. Factory sealed box here, folks. Complete, and it right here, as you can see, is the shipping label. All right, this is right off the pallet. It's a good one here, folks. All right, we'll set that here. We will break this thing here in just a second. Anybody's interested in grabbing a number? Now's the time to do it. Now's the time to do it. And yeah, if, if I throw dice here after we do this box break, yeah, Snake Eyes will, Snake Eyes wins the case. That'll be $5 throws, and Snake Eyes will get you the case. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, so here we go, folks, last chance, because as soon as I crack this, no other number, no other numbers will be taken. All right, here we go, where's the knife? Where's the knife? Well, there it is. Knife in my hand. All right, guys, here we go, here we go. Let's break this puppy. One slice, two slice, three slices here. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, man. Gotta love a nice box break here, folks. Holy cow, holy cow. Ah, I love that new car smell. All right, guys, so what will happen here is I'm going to pull from left to right. I'll start here, and we will go across this way and back. 
all the way down and through. Boom, 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 and boom. And then we'll do the other side. All right, good luck, guys. Here we go, here we go. Bad Timmy has the first 10. So here we go. I'll start over here. We'll pull the very first one. And it is the Volkswagen Baja Bug. That's number one. Bad Timmy's got the first 10 here. Here's number two. It is the Road Bandit. That's number two out of the box. Number three out of the case for Bad Timmy is the Head Gasket. Head Gasket, that's number three. Here comes number four. So I start back now on this side, coming back the other way. Number four is the Treasure Hunt, the Mustang Funny Car Treasure Hunt. That's number four for Bad Timmy. Here comes number five, right here. It is the Lamborghini Urus. It's the bull. The bull, the bull, the bull. That's number five. Five down, five to go for Bad T here. Next one, the Blade Runner. Blade Runner. That is number six. Two, three, four, five, six. Here comes number seven. Now back here and back across this way. Number seven, the Arachnoid. Arachnoid, that's seven. Number eight is the, oh, the 2017 Acura NSX. Nice little Acura. All right, here we go. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Here's number nine. Number nine is the Nissan. That Nissan R390 GT1. And then number 10 is Another Lamborghini Urus. Lamborghini Urus. Check it out. Check it out. So that's the first 10 numbers right there. So we got Bad T on his. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. All right. We get that tag. And then it looks like Patrick Chandler has the next one. All right, guys. Give me just a second here while I get these all placed on the logging cart here. All right. So now we have Patrick with the next one. Alrighty, and Patrick is going to get, oh, he's got a good one, the 2020 Ford Mustang Shelby GT, Shelby GT 500, it's a good one, alright, now Hack has the next poll, alright, so what do we pull for Hack here, it is the 2010 Pro Stock Camaro. Pro Stock Camaro, all right. That's heck. Patrick has number 13. All right, so what does Patrick have here? All right, so we start back on this side and go back this way. First one out is the 2016 Ford GT. Oh my gosh, I love this car. One of my favorite castings out of this box I've seen so far is that Ford GT race. That is killer. Killer, cool, killer, cool, killer, cool. All right, so that was Patrick. Now we go back to Hack. All righty. And what does Hack get here? The next one out of the box is the Carbonator. Okay, so, so all right. you know, there, are, there are a few fantasy pieces in here. A few fantasy pieces in there. All right, so now we go back to Patrick with number 15. <coughs> Excuse me there. Woo. All right, so here we go, here we go, here we go. So Patrick, what does he get? He gets the, whoop, don't you fall over, don't you fall over. The Robocar, Robo Race Robocar. That's interesting, I guess. All right. Then we come back to Hack. And then number 17 is a house car. All right, so Hack gets the... Let's see here. What's coming up for Hack here? The next pull out of the box as we come to this side and back now. And I think you might like this one, buddy. It's a 2017 Camaro. ZL1. All right, the next one out is a house car. So I will pull that one. 
So we'll get that one out of here. You can't see what that one is because it is a house car. <laughs> so then number 18, we go back to hack. All right, so let's see here. What's he get? What's he get as we pull out? It is the Zombot. The Rock'em Sock'em Robot Zombot. Right there, 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 there. So let's see. So far, hack, you got the Pro Stock Camaro, the Carbonator. The 2017 Camaro and the Zombot. All right, that was hat. Number 19 is a house car. So you can't see what that one is either. You can't see what that one is either. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Hack has number 20, the 20th pole. All right, so here we go. I can only see the back of the card as I'm pulling it out. You're gonna like this one. Oh, please be, please be. Damn. It is the 71 Bluebird, or the Datsun 510, I mean, but it's the main. It's not the Super, darn it. Not the Super. Now, Bad Timmy did get the T-Hunt. Heck, you got that one. You got that one. So here we go, here we go. Lance has the next pull. The 21 spot. All right, two bucks. Here we go, here we go. And oh, it's another blue, it's another 71 Dotson, but is it the main line? Darn it, darn it, darn it. Don't fall over get there, guys. Don't fall over, you gotta stay in order. You have to stay in order. There we go, perfect. All right. Number 22 now, that's Hack. What's he get here? We come back over to now this side and we go that way. It is the Baja Blazers Toyota Off-Road Truck. It's another pretty cool one, pretty cool one in that box. All right, number 23 is a house car. Can't see what that one is either, so whoops. All right, so then Hack has number 24. I think you'll like this one, buddy. It is the Toyota Celica. The 1970 Toyota Celica. That's a good one. That's got that almost spectra flame-like paint on it. That one's pretty doggone sweet. All right, now the next one, two, three, four, five. So Bad Timmy has 25 through 30. So here we go, here we go, here we go. All righty. So Bad Timmy has the, here we go with pull number 25. It is the custom Ford Bronco. Number 26 is the La Troca, the art truck one. Now that's cool, that's one of the cool ones Coolest ones I've seen in that casting in a while. All right, that's the 26th pole. The 27th pole is the Audi Avant RS2. All right, oh, that's a beauty. I like that blue, that's a good color blue. That's number 27. The 28th pole is gonna get him the Surfing School Bus, Surfing School Bus. That was 27, here is 28. All right, the next one in line is the Volvo 850 Estate. Okay, that was the 29th one, I'm sorry. I almost lost count there. I'm marking these as I go here. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, that was 29. And with the 30th pole, bad Timmy pulls the Nissan. That nice little Nissan R390 GT1. Yeah, I like that one. That one's cool, 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 cool. Oh, that was the 29th pull, I'm sorry. Right, 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 right. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. That one should have the 30 and 30, so there we go. Yep, that was the 30th pull. Bad Timmy, bingo. Bingo, bongo, boingo. Some good cars there, good cars there. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ah, uh, let's see. Now, Wayne is up next. He has number 31 through 41. 
All right. All righty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All righty, so here we go. So now, here we go. With the 31st pole, he gets the Mattel Dreammobile. 32nd, the Slide Kick. 33rd is the, really, the Minecraft Minecart. With the 34th pole, he gets the Eruption. 35th pole is the RV there yet. And the last pole out of the top half of the box is the Bone Shaker Moon Eyes. Moon Eyes Bone Shaker. That's a beauty, man. That's a cool one. Cool one, cool one, cool one. All right. So as you can see, that takes care of the top half of the box. I will take the paper out and we will jump to the next part of the box here and we shall continue. So here we go, folks. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, they're a little crank. Okay, they're a little goofy in the box here. There we go. Settle down, settle down, settle down. 37th pull. I come all the way over here to the far side. Let me get that first one out. It is the Rock'em Sock'em Robot Zombot. With the 38th pole, he gets the 2017 Camaro. 39th, is the, looks like it is, it is it's the Akram Batmobile. All right, so now I come over to the other side and start back with number 40. And it is the 77, oh, it's cool, it's that Ford GT. Love that GT, that's a cool one there. Cool one there, cool one there. All right. And with his last poll, what does he get? But the total disposal, garbage truck. Now, number 42 is going to be a house car, so you can't see what that one is, as they say. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, and here we go. Let me set these on the logging cart. As we close in, I'm filling out this, completing this box break here. All right, so the next one is a house car. So I come right here, here it is, and you can't see it. Put it over there. I don't even want to look at it because I don't want to know what it is. All right, we've got Lance up next. Alrighty, here we go. So what's he gonna get? We start back on this side, going this way. Nice, the 2020 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500. Nice car. Boy, oh boy, he got two good ones so far. The Datsun 510 and the Mustang. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Hack is up next with number 44. With the 44th pole, it's black. Oh, it's the Honda Civic Si. Hi, yeah, yeah. That's a hot car. That one, that one's making some noise right now around the in the collector's market. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right. So now Toby has the next one, two, three, four, five. The next six poles. All righty. So here we go, folks. And then, boy, then we got a big jump of house cars coming up. So here we go, here we go, here we go. So, so here we go. So the next six are Tobys. So here we go. And in the correct order, we pull out the first one, the Acura NSX. Nice little Acura. There's number one. Here comes number two, the La Troca, the art car, Tro La Troca. All right, we follow that up. Here's number three. It, oh, it's, ah, it's that cool Toyota Celica. That really nice one. That one that could easily be a super. Put real riders on and it's gonna look like a super. Here comes the next one, another Akram, Akram Batmobile. That's four. Here comes number five. So we start back on the other side. Oh, he gets the Porsche 935. 
Porsche, Porsche, Porsche. That's a sweet one. And then with his last one, what's he get? Oh, it's another black one. Oh, it's the Mercedes Benz. Ay, ay, ay. Another good car. Another good car there. That Mercedes Benz 500E. Man, that's some killer stuff there. Killer stuff, killer stuff. Killer stuff there. All right. Oops, I need a little more room here on the cart. Drop down here to the bottom. All right, there we go. All right, now, let's see here. I got to pull one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I got the next eleven are house cars. So here we go. All right, we'll start here just the way it's supposed to be. One, two, three, four. Back over to the other side, five, six, and seven, eight, nine, ten, the next three in a row, and then one on the far side, that's the 11, all right, so there we go, all right, we're getting down to it here, folks, down to it, down to it, these are all house cars, so let me put these over here in the other box. Alrighty, cool bananas. Alright, now I got Lance with the next one. He gets the, oh nice, the Volvo Estate. Volvo Estate Wagon, that's another good one. Alright, then we have one, two, three more house cars. One, two. Oops, stand back up there. And in the correct order, number three. Then I have Hack with the next one. It is the T Rex Destroyer. T Rex Oil Destroyer. Yeah, that one. That one, that one, that one. All right. All right. So down to the final six cars here. The next two are house cars. So I will pull those in order. One and two. All right, and here we go. Now Lance has the next one. What's he gonna get? It is the tuned twin mill. It's actually a pretty cool little casting there. Then we have two more house cars, and then Lance has the last one. So here's one, here's two in the correct order, which leaving number 72. And what is Lance going to get here? Why, it is the, the Land Rover Defender 90. All right, well, we had the T-Hunt, but we didn't have the Super in that case, so that bodes well. All right, so far, I think we've only had one Super come out, and this is this is the second box break today, no Super. So these other sealed boxes, some, there's got to be a Super here somewhere. Got to be a Super in one of these. All right, so as you can see here, folks, the box is empty. All right, and I will say this, guys, I will say this. The, out of these house cars, the super was not the super was not there. Super was not there with these. All right. Trust me, if the super was there, I'd have that up front right now, trying to sell that critter. So, um, right. but these will make nice prize cars if it comes down to that. Right, let me get these all packed back in here, like so. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, looky there, looky there, looky there. Here we go. So Bad Timmy's going to take four dice rolls on a case. All right, I will do that, guys. I will do that. I'll put a case up for dice. All right, Bad Timmy's going to take eight of four rolls, and Confederate Captain's going to take eight. All righty, so Bad Timmy, four rolls. All 
All right, so I've got Bad Timmy with four, then Confederate. It's going to take eight rolls. All right, so here we go, here we go, here we go. Let me get my prize box back here. Let me put these house cars away. That way I'm pulling from this really good box here. All right, that box is open. All right, let me move that. All right, so here we go, here we go. Let's get this set up and we'll get some dice a flying here. All right, here we go. Oops, it's a little twisted, let me untwist. All right. There we go. All right, so here we go. All right. Camera's working good. All right, so I may have to adjust that on the fly a little bit there. I'll adjust that just a bit. I want you to see more of the field here, as they say. Oh man, this is harder to do, harder than it looks. There we go, all right, so there we go. All right, so Bad Timmy's got four rolls. Here we go. We're at the first throw. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. We have a five and a four. Five, and I need to bring that down a little bit, don't I? We need, there we go, five and a four. That's number one. Here comes number two for Bad Timmy. Here we go, here we go. Here's roll number two. Ooh! Look at that, so close. One and a three. One and a three. Here comes roll number three. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Roll number three and in the box. Ah, uh, three and a four. Three and a four. Here comes roll number four. Bad Timmy's fourth row here. Let's do it. Here we go, 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 and in the box. Ah, three and a two, all right. Let me pull four cards out of the prize box here real quick for Bad Timmy. Here we go, I'll reach in here and I'll pull them at random. He has the Blade Runner. Ah, the T-Rex Destroyer, yeah. The, ooh, the Toyota Celica. Toyota Celica, and the, oh, the Ain't Fair. Now this bus, this Ain't Fair bus, the Metro Rapid Route bus, that's been a, that's a really popular piece right now. I don't know why, but it is. All right, so now Confederate Captain has eight rolls here. So here we go, here we go. So let's go, Confederate Cap. The next eight throws are his. Here we go, here we go, here we go. The next eight for Confederate Cap. So here we go. First throw. Number one is, ah, six and three. Roll number one. Here comes number two. Number two, number two, number two. Here we go. Oh, look, can't get any closer than that, can we? Twos, twos, holy cow, double twos. It's roll number two, here comes number three. Number three, number three, number three. Here we go, 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 and in the box. Oh, for the love of pickles. Three, one and two, one and two, one and two. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh we're getting close. We're getting close, we're getting close. Ay, ay, ay. Here we go. Roll number four. Roll number four. Bad Timmy says he is gonna take four more, I think he said there. Yes, he did. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Next is roll number four. Oh, six and a one, six and a one. Oh, the ones are there. The ones are showing up. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here comes number five. Here comes number five. Five alive, here we go, here we go, and in the box. Uh, double fives, double fives, uh-oh. When I start throwing ones and I start throwing doubles, that's always a good sign. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Number six. 
Here we go, and in the box. Oh, four and a two, four and a two. All right, Confederate Caps got two more throws here. Two more, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it. Here we go, 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 and in the box. Ah, uh, five and a two, five and a two. Oh, come on now. Here it is. Here's the eighth throw for Confederate Captain. Shake those up, rattle those bones. Here we go, here we go, and in the box. Oh, boy, we went the wrong way there. Ay, 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 all right. Let me get eight cars out of the box here. Timmy's gonna take four more here. All right, here we go, here we go. Let me, let's pull. We gotta pull eight cars here. Here we go, here we go, here we go. First one, the Draftinator. Second one, the Toyota Off-Road Truck. All right, so the Draftinator will, do, he says to donate to Fantasy Cars, all right. Uh, well, I'll tell you, let me put this one up here because it is I guess you consider that you would consider that one a fantasy. The Draftinator. I'm guessing we would consider that one a fantasy piece. All right, here we go. Here we go. <clears throat> here we go. Number three out of the box is the Mercedes Benz. Number four is the Lamborghini Urus. Number five, oh, a second Lamborghini Urus. Number six, the Volvo Estate. Number seven is the Audi, Audi Avant, Audi Avant. And the eighth one to come out of the box here is the Donate Minecart. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. All right. There we go. We got those. And I got Bad Timmy on four. And then Hack on one. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's do this. <coughs> Excuse me, goodness. All right, here, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, let's get back to the dice cam. Four throws for bad tea here, here we go. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. And in the box. Six and a four, hmm. Come on now. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it again, do it again. Oh, three and a one, three and a one. We're close. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here's roll number three and in the box. Five and a two. Come on now. Come on, come on, come on. Snake, snake, snake. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Roll number four and in the box. Ah, poop. Poop, 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 and poop. All right, I gotta pull four out of here for bad tea. So let's see what we get here. Let's see what four we pull out of here for bad Timmy. So here we go, here we go, here we go. All right. First one, the Mercedes Benz. Second one, is the custom Ford Bronco. Third one, the Moon Eyes Dodge Van. And the fourth one, what's it gonna be? Oh, the Nissan, all right, that Nissan R390 GT1. All right, Hack's gonna take a throw here. Here we go, so let's go with Hack. All right, Hack taking a crack. Hat gonna take a crack at it here. Here we go. Here we go. And here we go. All right, come on now. 
shake, rattle, and roll, and in the box it goes. Ah, fudge pops. Nine. Man, oh man, oh man. Anyway, here we go into the box, and what's he get? Oh, cool beans. It's the Moon Eyes Bone Shaker. Moon Eyes Bone Shaker. All right, guys. All right. Anybody else for anybody else want to take a crack at it? Anybody else want to take a shot at a case here? Five dollars a throw. Five dollars a throw. Snake eyes will get it. I think the odds for snakes are one out of every 32 throws. I think is what st statistics will tell you that one out of every 32 throws should be a snake. Bad Timmy says two more. All righty. Whoops, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it, do it, do it. Come on now. Come on, come on, come on. Here we go. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it. And in the box. Oh, man. Ah, yeah, yeah, we're flirting way too much. Flirting way too much there. No, I already got hacks, Timmy. We already, I just did hacks right before that. So there's three and one, and here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, and in the box. Oh, poop, 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 poop. poop. All right, here we go. Here we go, here we go. First one, the Acura NSX, and the Road Bandit, Road Bandit. All right. Bad T says two more. <laughs> All right, buddy, you got it. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Actually, I do need to pull the thing out and we need to drop down to the next layer in the prize box. I will miss, should be exciting because I have no idea what's under here. Could be good, could be good. You just never, ever know, do you? All right. So here we go, here we go. Two throws here. Come on. Snake, 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 snake. All right, and in the box it goes. Ah, five, two and a three. And here we go. Here we go, here we go. All right, in the box. Uh, double fives, double fives. Horse feathers, horse feathers, horse feathers, horse feathers. Well, I can think of other things I'd like to say other than horse feathers, but you know, you know, you know, you know. All right, so here we go, here we go, here we go. In the box, reach in here. First one we pull out is the Moon Eyes Dodge Van. Second one is the, oh, it's a Volvo 850 Estate. All right. So there we go, there we go, there we go, folks. All right, anybody else here? What do you say, what do you say, what do you say there, my friends? And like I said, uh, let's see, wow, it's only 930. Boy, oh boy. Confederate Cap says, two more got you, buddy. All right. So here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh man, oh man, oh man. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? We're gonna get the dice, we're gonna throw them, and we're gonna throw a snake. Come on now, I can just feel it. I know there's a snake lurking. There's a snake of brewing. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. Better cap. Two throws here. All right, here we go. Let's shake it. Rattle it. Roll it. And in the box. Oh, a six and a one. Six and a one. That's the second time I've done that for Confederate cap with the six and one. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And in the box. Come on. Come on. Come on. Rats. All right. Poop. 
Here we go, folks. In the box. Oops. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. In the box. Let's see here. What do we got? Oh, nice. The Toyota Celica. That really nice Celica. That's pretty cool. All right. Next one. What do we got? Oh, sweet. Uh, Honda Civic Si. Two cool cars right there. Man, oh man, oh man. Two cool, nice JDMs right there. I mean, you know, could have been better, could have been worse, but not so bad. Joe Phoenix says he will do too. All right, got you, buddy. Uh, Joe is in the house. All right, so here we go, here we go. Let me get these all stacked properly. All right, Joe, you got it, buddy. You got it, you got it. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Two throws for Joe here. All right, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it in the box. Five and a two, ah, poopy. Comes number two. Number two, number two, number two, and in the box. Oh, one and three, ah, so close. So close, so close, so close, so close. All right, so here we go into the box. Reach down here deep, what do we get? Ah, the 2017 Camaro, ZL1. And back down into the box we go. What do we got, what do we got, what do we got? It is the, ooh, the 2020 Mustang Shelby GT500. Couple cool cars there, couple cool cars. All right, nice, nice, nice. All righty, guys, what do you say here? What do you say, anybody else? Anybody else here? We're flirting. It's bound to happen. The more throws, the more. <laughs> Sooner or later, it's gonna hit. All righty, guys, what do you say there? What do you say, what do you say? Uh, if you guys want, we could try another, we could do another, uh, we could do another 15 spot LMS on a case. Could do another 15 spot last man standing, if you guys want. Could do that. Uh, if there's any of these pieces I showed you up front that you would like to maybe possibly do an LMS on. Uh, I don't know, let's see. Let's see, let's see if we were to, if we were to, like the, uh, let's see here. Let me do some quick calculating in my head here. Alrighty guys, I would do 20 spots at $9 a spot for a crack at the Golf Raptor. 20 $9 spots, if, some, if you want to take a crack at that. I would gladly give that a shot as well. What do you say here guys? That, or we could last man stand another case, I could throw more dice. Or yeah, I don't know, we could do just about, just about anything here. Um, how we could do, you know what we could do, what we could do, and what we could do, right here, right here, right here on this one. This one here would be, this is the, that is, of course, this is the Car Culture Team Transporter. This is the Legends Tur Transporter. I could do 10, $10 spots on that. All right, so Joe was in first. Joe, Joe was in first here on uh, Last Man Standing. Uh, the question is, what are we going to do the last man standing on? Are you guys, are you guys wanting to go on a case, on a, on a case here, or are you on something else? I showed three different things here. Uh, the numbers started coming in, so I'm not sure what you guys were jumping in on there. All right. So it's going to depend on how many numbers I write down here. Joe, what are you, what are you jumping in there on? Bad Timmy says case. Joe. What were you jumping in on, buddy? Were you jumping in on a case also? It'll be 15 spots. We do 15, just like the last one, 15 $8 spots.
All right, here. All right. Okay, okay. So, all right. So let me look at these here. All right. So we will randomize. So okay, the random numbers first for Joe. So here we go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. As you know, I do this little goofy thing with my finger here. Number eleven. That's number one. Number one there. Let's see here. He's taking five randoms. So I got five randoms for Joe here. All right, so here comes number two. Number 14. All righty. I got three more there. So here we go, 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 here we go. Number five. That's number three for Joe. All right, here comes the next one. Number three. And here comes, all right, number, the number five here it goes to number, looks like 15. All right, so I got Joe there. All right, bad Timmy at six, seven, and eight. All right, then I do believe Felon, uh, let's see here. Felon, Felon, Felon. Felon wants number nine. All right, I got Felon on nine. All right, let me get caught up here, guys. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can, use, you can use points for one spot, for one spot. I can allow you to use points for one spot per LMS on that. Cap will take 13 with points, all righty. All right, so that leaves one, two, four, 10, and 12. One, two, four, 10, and 12 on that one. All righty. One, two, four, 10, and 12. All right, now, also, also, folks, here, let me put up another loose one here real quick. $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose, $3 loose. So let me grab some more stuff to put up front here. Grab some more pieces here. Um, oh, what do I got? Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. Hang on a second. I forgot something else I was going to put up here this evening, guys. Something else I was going to put up here this evening is... We get a quick count here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, fourteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Guys, I've got a box here. I've got a box here. This box has 31 Batmobiles in it. There's a Batcopter. I think there's a Batcopter in there too. But 31 different Batmobiles. 31 different Batman cars here. Uh, there's a color shifter Batmobile in there. Uh, there's a couple of, well, let's see, there's the purple one and the blue and the blue one. Blue one's got the chrome base, purple one's got the, brand, uh, the black base. 31 different Batmobiles here. 31 different Batmobiles, if anybody's interested in that. 31 different ones, I will sell a lot of them. We'll sell a lot of them. Or I could put them up individually. I'd rather sell them as one big lot, but hey, you know. Uh, the gumball car, I've not seen it yet. I know it's here somewhere. I just haven't haven't seen that one yet. We had, what was it? I one, one or two people got them on LMSs earlier this evening. All right, so I don't know if anybody's interested in the Batmobiles, we can do that. All right, guys, there's your loose one there. Let me switch that loose one real quick. Let's go with, there's a little $3 loose for you. All 
All right, let me get some other things here for you. Really quick here. All right, let me grab some stuff out of the box here and I'll put up another little nice grouping of cards here for you. It'll be another one money takes all kind of thing. All right, here we go, here we go. I got four good ones here for you. Four good ones here for you. All right, check it out, check it out. By the way, guys, by the by, by the by, and by the by, here we go. This is, this is that Parnelli Jones, 1974 Mustang. In the Canadian release, the vintage racing. Starting bid on this, guys, $40 to start this one tonight. You know this one was tagged at over $100. $40 will start the bidding on this one here tonight. If you want that Parnelli Jones Mustang. All right, so here we go, folks. Here we go, here we go. I have a power panel. I have a 2010 new model Toyota Land Cruiser. I have from the Night Burner series, a 1970 Plymouth Road Runner. And from Asphalt Jungle, the Combat Ambulance, the Wild Pig Hot Dog Truck, or panel, or whatever you want to call it there. So there we go, folks. Four nice ones here for you. One money takes all. One money takes all here. So check it out, check it out. There they are. Oh, let me look at that camera way off the mark there. Way off the mark. Bring that over again, back to where I need it. So you can see these four. We'll back this out a hair or two or three. There we go. Check it out, folks. Check it out, check it out. And there you have it. There you have it, there you have it. Don't forget, guys, the RLC Golf Raptor, $185, folks. $185 is the start on it tonight. If you want it, by golly, now is the time to grab it. Before, before Picasaurus tunes in and says, what the hell are you doing, Metal? So here we go there, folks. Anybody on those? Looking for a bid, looking for a bid, looking for a bid. Looking for a bid. Check it out, check it out, check it out and check it out. Five on the bid, here we go. Clock is hot, clock is hot. I got five on the bid, five on the bid, five on the bid. Five or five or five or hacks in there on it. Got hack in there at five, hack in there at five. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Who the bid? Who the bid? Who the bid? Who the bid here? Who the bid? Who's gonna get it? Who's gonna get it? Good question. Good question. Good question. Right? Holy pick! Holy pick! Holy pick! Holy pick! What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Hacks on the deal. Hacks on the deal. Hack on the deal, check it out, check it out, check it out. And it looks like Hack has got it. Sold, 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 and sold. Hack with the deal. All right. This situated here. There we go. All right. So 
here are, this is the box that has the Batman cars in it, right here, right here, right here, there, I have, how many did I say were in there, 31, 31 of them, 31 Batman related vehicles here, right here guys, check it out, check it out, check it out, right there, right there, right there. Uh, let me see here. Let's see. Let me go to this camera here and I'll walk over here with the box and I'll set it kind of towards the back here. Kind of give you a bit of an idea what you're looking at here. All right, so here we go. There we go, my friends. There we go. You can kind of see the ones on top there. There is the color shifter. There is the color shifter one there. And there they are. That's the box of them there. You got 31 Batman related vehicles in that box, folks. 31 of them. 31 of them right there. So there they are. Now let me get some more stuff up front here. Some more goodies up front. All right. And guys, we still have only one, two, four, and ten. One, two, four, and ten. And we'll do another last man standing on a factory sealed H case. All right, while we're thinking of that, let me get in the box here. Let me get five other cool ones here. Two or four. Yeah, I'll put them up four at a time here. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Whoops, wrong button once again. There we go, there we go, there we go. Joe says two more random LMSs, all right. Here we go, two more randos. Number 12. And number, number 10, well, okay. Now I just have one, two, and four left. One, two, and four left, and we'll do the LMS, all right? One, two, and four, and we'll run the LMS. <clears throat> all right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We have a shoe box. I have a 1935 Caddy. I have a Canyon Carver. Then I have the really cool Scorching Scooter here. Uh, this is this is one of the this is the cooler one right here. Check it out. Check. Get out, there you go, there you go. The Hot Wheels City Works Scorching Scooter. Four nice ones, four nice ones. What do you say here, what do you say, what do you say? Check them out, check, whoops, check them out. Looking for a bid, looking for a bid, looking for a bid. Looking for a bid. What do you say, what do you say, what do you say? How about it, how about it, how about it? Who to bid, who to bid, who to bid, who to bid? Who's gonna get it? Check it out, check it out, check it out. All right, nobody on those? Nobody on those, all righty. All righty, I'll pull it in favor of something else here. Pull it in favor of something else. And what will that something else be? Well, let's just have a little fun here. Let's just have a little fun. Just a little fun. Not a whole lot of fun, but just a little fun. All right, so let me pull those. Mm. All right, so we get those out of there. How about I give you something from the H box? All right. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. The 2010 Pro Stock Camaro. The Moon Eyes Bone Shaker. And the Moon Eyes Dodge Van. Moon Eyes Dodge Van. Here you go, here you go, and here you go. Check them out, check them out, and check them out. 
Here they are, ladies and gentlemen, right there, right there. What do you say here? What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? From the H box, from the H box, three pretty cool ones here, guys. Pretty cool ones here. We'd like to see at least 10 to start this, at least a 10 to start that. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? What do you say here, guys and gals? How about it? How about it? How about it? How about it? Dave's giving me a five. I'd like to see a little more than five. Would like to see more than five here, guys. Man, oh man, oh man. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm not supposed to put the H case cars up like this. All right, guys, I'm going to clock it. We'll see what happens here. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I can, I'll do it once, and <laughs> if that, that's where we go, that's where, that'll be the last grouping of three, at least out of the H-Box for now. But those are three pretty cool ones there. Three pretty cool ones there, and I got a five on the bid, five on the bid, five on the bid. Five on the bid. I have a 2002 first edition coming up, and it will be a buy it now. It will be a buy it now, and I'll have, how many of these do I have? I have eight of them. I have eight of them here. So here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Check it out, check it out, check it out. And that is sold, sold, sold. All right. I believe there is out. I know there's a color variation. I think it's a dollar store, or uh, there's an ex there is a color variation exclusive. Um, I just can't remember remember which. I think it's blue, right? I think it's blue. Yeah, Patrick, we did, we did, we did. All right, guys. I do have a buy it now coming up here. All right. I have, I forget how many did I say I had? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have eight of these guys. It is a 2002 first edition. This will be a $5 buy it now. You can buy one. You can, you can take as many as you want here. As many as you want here on this one. Check it out, check it out. It is the custom 69 Chevy. This is a 2002 first edition, $5 buy it now. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say here? Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Kroger exclusive. That's it. Hack is going to take one. Toby wants five of them. All right. So I got Hack on one. Toby with five. That's six. I think I've got two more left. I do believe I have two more left. Yep, two more up for grabs. If anybody wants them, I have two more of those custom 69 Chevys available. Anybody else? Anybody else? Two left. Alrighty, I'll pull that one and I'll get something else. I've got a couple other potential buy it nows here. Alright, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have seven of this next one. Seven of this next one. Hack says he'll take a second one. Alright, you got it. All right, all right, and all right. What the jalapeno, right? That's right. That's a good casting, though. That That's a really good one there. All right, guys, I got seven of these, did I say? Yeah, seven of these. 
This is also a 2002 first edition. This one's really cool. All right. This is a really cool piece right here. This is a Corvette SR2. This is a first edition, folks. First edition, look at this beauty. This thing is slick. $5 buy it now, seven available. $5 buy it now, I have seven of those available. What do you say, what do you say, what do you say? How about it, how about it? Check it out, folks. Check it out and check it out. That's pretty doggone cool right there. $5 buy it now. Great little first edition. Alrighty, I've got 12 of this next one. 12 of this next one right here. It's also a first, 2002 first edition. This, 12 of these available. It is the 1940s Ford Coupe. $5 buy it now. 12 of them available. First edition. What is it? Rick always tells you, collect first editions and final runs. Well, here you go. This is a good one. This is another one of those really cool ones. Really cool first edition pieces there. 12 of those available. If you want them, grab them, grab them, grab them. Toby's gonna take three, got you buddy. Got Toby at three. Anybody else? Anybody else? This is one pretty slick little deal here. Pretty slick little deal on those. All right. What's next on the list of first edition buy it nows? I have seven of this next one. Seven of this next one. 2002 first edition it is the 68 mercury cougar first edition cougar check it out there you go my friends right there right there if you want that one grab it grab it grab it great little first edition that one is killer 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 hack's gonna take one Anybody else there? That is a sweet little piece right there. Great little first edition. 68 Cougar. Cougar, Cougar, Cougar. Alrighty. That's all right. I'll just keep them coming because I got another. I've got six of this next one six of this next one now this one was loose earlier this afternoon or earlier this evening i had this one up as a loose one which was quickly gobbled up but let's see i do have six of these carded so here we go folks check it out here is your 64 buick riviera first edition 2002 first edition, almost 20 years old. 19 year old first edition there. Check that out, $5 buy it now. $5 buy it now. Get it, get it, get it there, ladies and gentlemen. Hack's gonna take one. All right, I got hack on one, anybody else? Anybody else there, guys? What do you say? What do you say? Some good first editions here. Some good first editions. All right. Well, let's just keep the hits a coming. Let's go back a few. Let's go a few years older. 
model, model style here, a few years older. Here you go, I have a 57 Cadillac Eldorado. 2002 first edition. Check it out, folks. There you go. $5, buy it now. $5, buy it now. I have six of those available. Six of that one available. If you want it, now's the time to jump on it. Six of those crazy critters available. I think I've just got one more, one more buy it now on the first edition here after this one. I just need somebody to grab number one and number two and we'll have that last man standing on another case. Number one and number, uh, one, two, and four. One, two, and four. Three numbers left there. Three numbers left. All right, nobody for that one. How about the custom 59 Cadillac first edition? I only have two. I only have two of this one right here. If you want it, $5 buy it now. I have two of them. Only have two of those available. If you want them, grab them, grab them, grab them. All righty. All right, guys, all right. That's what I have as far as buy it now with the first editions and stuff. I did do a buy it now on this first edition earlier. I have five of them still, 2002. This is the Nissan Skyline. What is that Nissan Skyline? $5 buy it now. Five of, I have five of those left if anybody wants one. Anybody wants one of that one? All you gotta do is grab it, grab it, grab it. Pretty cool one, pretty cool one, pretty cool one there. Alrighty. Alright my friends, All right, I'll tell you what I'll do here. Uh, let me put up, let's grab some more cars out of the H case, what do you say? What do you say? What do you say here? What do you say? All right, guys, anybody want the Datsun Bluebird? Uh, I'm sorry, the Datsun 510. I always keep wanting to say Bluebird. Anybody want the 510? Here is the 510, folks. Check it out, check it out. There you go, there's your little 510. Pretty cool one there. Here's that uh, Ford Shelby. And of course the Toyota Celica. This Celica is really cool. I tell you this one here just, it, it glows literally. That paint just pops on that thing. That one's really cool right there as well. So check that out. Guys, I'll sell all three of them, but I have to, I'm going to have to have, I need 10. I'll have to start it at 10. What do you say here? What do you say? What do you say? What do you say here? That's three really good ones right there.
Uh, 69 Hobbs wants the 510. All right. Guys, I can do these at $5 buy it nows if you want. If you want. On the 510, if you want that one, buddy, I'll definitely mark that down for you. Five ten, it's a cool car. I know we had some of the older ones that come in out of that last collection. We had a few of those, and those were really sweet. Alrighty, guys. All right. Oh, it's got a bent J hook. Uh, this has got a crease along the crease along the peg hook here check that out guys I'll tell you what there it is there it is three bucks three bucks three bucks first person to say grab it gets it that is the Ford GT 2017 Ford GT does have a bad does have a bad crease on it three dollars if you want it grab it straighten some things up here I like to kind of try to clean up my mess a little bit I know sometimes I walk into some craziness but uh, I don't like to leave craziness behind if I can keep from it so I'm gonna work on straightening some of this up here Alrighty guys, so here we go, here we go, here we go, ladies and gentlemen, alright, so let's get back to it here. Alright, anybody else want to jump in on that LMS? I've got three numbers left there, three numbers left, three numbers left, three numbers left. I've not come across any flash sliders tonight. Uh, the boxes that are, uh, the two boxes I brought in, so far no flash sliders, still looking, but so far none there. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go. Tell you what, let me put this one up here. Blue card brown back. We have a blue card brown back piece here. It is the BMW 850i. A nice little Beamer right there, blue card brown back. That one's pretty sweet. That is definitely a pretty cool one there. Check that one out, folks. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Let's see what else we got here. All right, come on now. Come on, come on, come on. Where'd all the big cars go? Somebody's holding out on me here somewhere. Check that one out, folks. What do you say there? What do you say there? Let me see what's it. Let me see if I can grab something real quick. Tell you what, here, folks, here we go. Let's see what you think about these. Gold medal speed, Dodge Viper. Blue card brown back, Dodge Viper, gold medal speed. 
Uh, new model, collector number 200, 210, Dodge Viper, another blue card brown back. And I have a gold, another gold medal speed Dodge Viper RT10. There you go, there you go. Now here's three interesting pieces for you. Three pretty doggone interesting little ones right here. Check them out, check them out, and check them out. Boom, boom, and boom. Right there, right there, and right there, guys. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say there, folks? Guys, also, we do have two factory sealed boxes of the of the Exotic Envy series. Two factory sealed boxes. Those will be five dollars each. Um, uh, I've got a five dollar bid there. The factory sealed box is hundred dollars a box. You get two. You get two sets. That's two Bugattis. That's two Lamborghinis. Four Aston Martins. And the McLaren Senna. You'll get two of those. Hundred dollars a box or fifty dollars a set. I heard that some of those went out pretty cheap over the weekend. Uh, I heard you guys got some pretty good deals on some of those over the weekend. But hey, that's awesome, man. Get the deals when you can, right? You get them and go. You get them and go. Five on, oh my goodness gracious. Am I, five on these guys, come on, come on. Check those out here. Man, oh man, oh man. That's three nice Vipers right there. Three awful nice Vipers. Those should be $5 a piece. We're talking blue card, brown back, gold medal speed, variations here. Ay, ay, ay. Well, I did it once tonight when I shouldn't have. I'm going to do it a second time here. I may just go back to single cars here shortly. Here we go. Here we go. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Five is the bid. Let's get it, get it, get it. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Five on the bid. Five on the bid. Five on the bid. All right, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Somebody want to grab one, two, and four? One, two, and four, so we can do the LMS for a factory sealed case. One, two, and four. So all we need is one, two, and four, and we'll do the last man standing for the factory sealed box. Damon, what's up, buddy? How you doing, man? Well, I saw you scored a killer, killer uh, Legends Tour truck this afternoon. Now you have two. Well, there you go. There you go, and there you go. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, Damon. I've got a couple, couple pretty good deals going on tonight. Uh, Rick told me to. Rick told me to do this, so I, I'm doing it. And let me show. Actually, I think I've only got one left. I do believe the other two have already sold. I have this one right here. This is the Texas Drive'em. It's the, now this was the one that, you know, the one that's popped off the thing there. Now, um, this one, had, they had wanted 300 for it, as, as is, you know, popped off the thing, all right? But, 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 but. Uh, so here's the deal on this one, guys. I'm cutting that in half to 150. To 150 for that. It'll, you'll have to have it as a loose one, but even loose, this thing is around almost $200 loose. All right, this is that Pittsburgh Con Collectors Convention one. Check it out, check it out, check it out. I'm looking for 150 on it if anybody wants to jump on that. Looking for a 150 there. That's that one. 
Uh, Steve, hey buddy, uh, we're LMSing a factory sealed H box. And in that, you have a chance of getting that $200 Bluebird, that 200, 200 uh, Datsun 510 Super out of that one. Also, Damon, I have the Golf Raptor. The Golf Raptor, 185, 185. All right, prices have been knocked way down on those. Way down on those, those are for sale if you want them. All right, uh, yeah, Steve, I have uh, one, two, and four left on that one. Number one, number two, and number four, eight dollars a spot. Last man standing for a factory sealed case. I do have the Cadillac funny car. The Caddy funny car. Check that out. They're looking for 30 on that one. That does have a $30 tag on it. On the Caddy, Caddy, Caddy funny car. All right. Let's see here. What else? What else haven't I shown tonight here in the backyard? Pretty much everything. Uh, of course, the Legends Tur Hauler. Legends Tur Hauler. Now, Ross does have that marked at 100 bones on that one. Then guys, I've also got this really super cool piece right here. This is number one of 25. Literally, in all seriousness, numbered one. Number one of 25. They're individually numbered from one to 25. This one is number one. This is a custom. This was for the Charlotte Nationals last year. Uh, this is from Pope uh, Designs. This is Brian Pope. And it is the custom Bojangles Gasser. Check that crazy critter out, folks. That is an insane custom right there. This is an insane custom right there. All right. Ah, I do have this one here. I didn't show this one. This is the custom Barracuda. This is an RLC as well. This is the custom Barracuda if it ever focuses. There we go. It's really nice looking. It's in the it's in the original 16 box. This one is numbered 318 of 6,000. 318 of 6,000. Check that one out. Guys, I'm knocking that down. $30 to start. 30 to start it. 30 to start that. Oh, you can't even see it, can you? Let me get the, let me hit you with the wide shot. You hit you with the wide shot here. There we go. Check that out. The original 16 repo. Check it out. $30, folks. That, that had been marked 50. $30. 30, 30, 30, 30, 30. If you want it, now's the time to grab it. It's a cool one. Cool one, cool one, cool one, cool one. All right. And all right, folks. Oh, man. Well, I told myself I wasn't going to put any of these up tonight. I told myself I just couldn't do it. I can't bring myself to do it. Can't bring myself to do it, but I guess it's time to bring out the gold. Since rumor has it that these are priced at gold prices, which we know are not. But, uh, yeah, now here we go. Here you go, folks. Ferrari F40. Little Ferrari F40. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Good little one there. Good little one there. Ferrari F40. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? And what do you say? Now, don't forget, guys, also, I have one, one more of this other set here. And Bad Timmy purchased one of these sets tonight. I've got one more left here. Let me show you what it is. Let me scroll this back through here. There's your pink uh, Scion, the Honda CRX, the, come on, focus. There we go. All right, let me start back again. There's your Scion FR6 in pink. There's your 88 Honda CRX. Your Volkswagen Golf MK2, the Nissan Skyline 2000 Turbo, and of course your Ford Focus. All right, $15 is the deal on this one. 
$15 is the deal on this set. It's a five car set. If you want it, somebody, all you gotta do is claim it. All you gotta do is say, take it and it's yours, 15 bucks. 15 bucks, Scion, Honda, Volkswagen, Nissan, Ford. All right, $15 for that. <laughs> oh, Toby, what are you doing to me, buddy? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing here? He says six on the Ferrari. Six on the Ferrari, huh? Six, six. Here we go. Here we go. Let's clock it. Let's clock it. Let's clock it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Let's go. Let's get it. What do you say? What do you say? Six on the bid. Six on the bid. Six on the bid. Ferrari, Ferrari, Ferrari. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get it. I got a six on the bid, six on the bid, six on the bid. Here we go. Nobody yet, heck, I've got three. Uh, the, fir the first LMS that we did, uh, Chris Tucker won the case. I've got three spots left on this second one. One, two, and four. Uh, that one is still available. Here we go, here we go. That is sold, sold, sold. I have no combies at this time. We haven't had Kobe, any combies in a while. Hopefully, we've got stuff coming in in the next couple days. Two massive sets coming in from what I've heard. And uh, it's hard telling what we're gonna have in all those. Hard telling here, hard telling, hard telling, hard telling. All right, guys, here we go, here we go. I'm a glutton for punishment here, here we go. Ferrari F50. Ferrari F50. Guys, somebody give me a 10 on that. Give me a 10 on that one. The F50 is just a little more expensive. Uh, Cap, I really don't want to break up the set. Really don't want to break up the set on that. Check that one out, folks. That one's a pretty good one there. That is the F50, folks. The F50. That one's pretty slick. Pretty slick, pretty slick, pretty slick. Now, I've been told these F50s, we're not supposed to sell them for <laughs> anything less than 20 to 25 but uh, here we go, folks. $10, I'll start it. $10, I will start it. Without hesitation. Alrighty guys, check that out, check that out. I've got something else to put up here real quick. Guys, I don't know if anybody's interested. I do have one T hunt from the H case. One T hunt from the H case here. 
but now it was sold for 15 today so that's where I have to keep the price at on this one if anybody's interested it is the Mustang funny car Mustang funny car there to be fair to the other buyer this afternoon I do have to keep that at 15 to start it 15 to start it check it out check it out check it out that's a great little tea hunt great little tea hunt Cody, what's up, buddy? What's up, what's up, what's up, and what's up? Cody Munger, how are you doing, my friend? Uh, ooh, I've got 69 Hobbs offering me 10 on the tea hunt. On the tea hunt. Guys, I gotta, I gotta do it at 15, though. Wouldn't be fair to the person that purchased it this afternoon to sell it cheaper right now. Not spe especially not in the same day. So I will have to stick to that on that one, guys. I'll have to, unfortunately. All right. Alrighty guys, I'll tell you what here. Well, let's see here. F50, F50, F50. Ay, 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 ay. Oh my goodness gracious. Here's a good one. Here's a good one. It's in a protector. I'll take it out of the protector if need be. Blue card, brown back, collector number 177. Here is the Ferrari 250. There's the Ferrari. 250 check that one out folks that's at least a ten dollar start it's actually worth more but i will start it at 10. if anybody wants it i'll start it at 10. check it out check it out what do you say there what do you say what do you say what do you say to that one looking for 10 looking for 10 looking for 10. good little one there my friends good little one there You're absolutely right, Hack. Absolutely right, buddy. That is a cool one. That is a cool one there. I got 10 on the bid, 10 on the bid, 10 on the bid. Here we go. Let's clock it and go, clock it and go, clock it and go, clock it and go. Here we go, folks. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Man, oh man, this one's gonna go a little cheap. Gonna go a little on the cheap side, but that's all right. That's all right. That's all right. It's all good. All good. All good. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now, here's a unique wheel variation on this next piece I got coming up. All right, guys. If we're gonna if we're gonna get this LMS in, guys, I need to sell spot one, two, and four. That's eight dollars a spot. I need to get one, two, and four sold here within the next three to four minutes. Otherwise, uh, I guess we'll let it carry over to tomorrow. That is sold, sold, sold. Good deal there. Good deal there. Actually, that's a steal of a deal.
All right, guys, here we go. Now this one, the white, the white wheels on this thing are, are a very, very hard to find, very hard to, that's kind of a rarer piece. It is, excuse me, it is the Lexus SC400. Check that one out, folks. Now this is a rare wheel, wheel variation on that one there, folks. Check that out, check that out. That's crazy cool piece right there, guys. And that's that's uh, not gonna go. That's not gonna go for five. I can tell you that. That one won't go for five. Check it out, folks. Check it out. Check it out. And check it out. All right, guys, I'll tell you what here. Um, let's see here. I've gone through pretty much everything I brought in tonight. I can rehash a few things. Uh, I'm looking around to see if there's anything, anything different that hasn't been put up yet. But I'm not really coming across anything. Let me keep digging, though. Let me dig a little further in these boxes here. I'll try popping up some other the pieces here as we go we'll just carry it out here we'll carry it on carry it out carry it over confederate cap says give me the last of the lms spots you got it buddy all right we will run that lms there we will definitely run that LMS. All right. So the wheel quit spinning, so I'll put another loose one up here real quick. I'll get the camera turned. We'll get the balls reloaded, and we'll run that LMS here. Just let me get a couple things organized here. Somebody's going to score a nice case again tonight, which is cool. I love getting, I love giving these cases away. Best thing we can do is give you guys cases. There. Let's get these balls loaded. 15 spots, eight bucks a pop. Winner's gonna get a factory sealed H box. So good luck here, everybody. Let me adjust the camera. All right, and we will run this critter, and that may that'll probably do it for tonight. I don't know. So it depends on how quick we get this run here, but uh, if we can get this, I think we can run through this pretty fast here. I've got the prize box right here ready to go. I do have the factory sealed box right here. All right, so that will go to the winner. Set that right back there. All right, folks, here we go, 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 and here we go. Oh, my goodness. Let me turn that just a little. All right, my friends, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, let's do this. Let's do this. I've got, so here's your numbers. Cap has one and two. Joe has three. Cap has four. Joe has five. Bad Timmy, six, seven, eight. Felon, nine. Joe, 10, 11, 12. Cap with points at number 13. Joe with 14 and 15. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Let's do this. Let's do it. First ball out, number one. Number one, number one, number one. Yikers, yikers, yikers. Cap right off the bat there. Right off the bat, that stinks. Stinks, 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 stinks. 
and it doesn't smell good either. It doesn't smell good either. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Real quick into the prize box. The Nissan R390 GTI. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna set these right here instead of running them over to the logging table. That way we can do this quicker. All right, here we go, here we go. Let's get the next one, next one, next one. Here we go. Back this way we bring it. Next ball out is number five. Number five, number five, number five. That's one of Joe's. All right. Well, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see what comes out of the box here, all right? Aha! Uh -huh. Mr. Happy, the VW at Cool V Dub. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it again, do it again, do it again, do it again. Let's wrap it up. Down and down and down it goes. I'm going to move these two back to the back here. There we go. So it doesn't get confusing. Boom. Number 12. Number 12. Number 12. That's Joe again. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Talk about luck of the draw, right? I know. Right, 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 right. The RV there yet. Okay. Yeah. The, now this this probably qualifies as the agony of defeat, right? So you, you had the joy of vic, kind of, you know, a little victory there with the VW, but then the RV there yet. So, uh, well, could be worse. Could be worse. Could be worse. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. We have number 11. Number 11, number 11, number 11. Joe again. Oh, come on now. This is getting horrendous here. All righty. Let's get deep down into the box here and let's see what we get. Ah, reach down, deep, down, deep, down, deep. Oh, this is cool. This is actually one of my favorite castings this year. It's the head gasket. You know, it's kind of like the, uh, you know, like those, it's got like a batting helmet on top of it kind of thing. That's actually one of my favorite crazier castings. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it again. And if we get another one here. Bing, bang, kapow, boing. It is number eight. Wait, number, I don't think I have to look at that because I'm pretty sure that is bad, Timmy. It is. All righty. And here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's reach into the box. Into the box. Into the box. Into the box. Ooh. Mine cart, crappy cart, crappy, 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 crappy. Here we go. Let's go, 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 go. Next ball out is naughty number nine. Number nine. Number nine. Number nine. Ah, felon. I would imagine this will probably be a donate. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's see if we can pull something halfway decent, though. The Rally Baja Crawler. I'm gonna mark that as a donate. I don't know if Felon is still with us or not there, but I'll mark it as a donate for now. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's do it again, do it again, do it again, and again. It's 
number 15. Number 15. Oh, no, now we're picking on Joe again. That's not right. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, sweet. The 2016 Ford GT race. That is a killer, killer casting. Man, oh, man. Probably one of the best ones in that besides the Super and the T-Hunt, you know, and the cool JDMs that the guys really like. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's get her, get her, get her. Let's do it again, do it again, and do it again. We have number seven. Number seven, Bad Timmy. The Toyota off-road truck. Well, that's definitely better than the first one. Definitely better than the first one. All right, here we go. Back to it. Number 10. Number 10, Joe. All right, gonna have to reach in the box again and pull something cool, 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 right? Right and right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Surfing school bus. I said cool, I didn't mean, well. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. One, two, three, we got six left, six balls left, here we go. Number six. Yep. Number six. Number six. Ah, bad tea. All right. Meanwhile, into the box we go. Another head gasket. And then there were five. Number two, number two, number two, number two, number two, number two. That is Confederate cap. something really good don't we something really good something I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know well I don't know but it is it's a BMW M3 GT2 there right there right there all right so here we go folks here we go we got four left four left four left you know what, Alex, the funny thing was, I only got to see about the first two laps of that race and the final ten. I was so freaking busy. We were show, so short-staffed. There was supposed to be five actual Speedway employees besides myself, and then I was supposed to have at least 15 volunteers. As you know, the Speedway has volunteer groups that come in. They're generally high school or church groups that come in to make money for their organizations, and they get paid to do the work. Well... We were supposed to have 25 of them total show up for the two sections. We only had five show up. So we were very short staffed, um, but uh, we made do. I kept busy all day, so yeah, but hey, you know what, but yeah. I'll tell you what, the, the finish, you know, after the finish of the race, I don't know if you guys seen it or not, uh, when he was doing his lap around in the pace car. And, uh, 
coming through, it came through our section. Everybody was well behaved. Everybody stayed where they were supposed to. Nobody jumped the fence, tried to climb the fence. When they got over into two, when they got over into turn two, a boy, a young boy somehow got through the fence and out onto the track and tried to climb in the car. Uh, that was, that was unbelievable. I think what he did was, I think he, he got into the photographer's area and kicked down the little photographer fencing that they dropped so they can put their camera lenses there to get, get shots of the cars when they come through. I think that's how I got through. And then the next thing you know, you had guys climbing all over the fence. So, <laughs> yikes, right? But I tell you, it was a good day. Good day. But like I said, don't be surprised if Helio doesn't get number five. Helio may be the first five-time champion and probably within the next two to three years. He's just that good at Indy. Sometimes things just haven't fallen his way. All right, guys. So here's what we got left here. Here's what we got left. We got four, four balls left here, all right? We have number 13 is Confederate Captain. That was on points. We have number 14, which is Joe. We have number three, which is Joe. And we have number four here, which is Confederate Cap. Oh my goodness gracious. So it's Confederate Cap and Joe. So here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah, a pink car, pink car, the milk was pink. Uh, you know, it was good stuff. It was good stuff. It was, it was kind of like what, really what Indy needed to, uh, you know, uh, that was, that there was the uh, largest attended sporting event since COVID. Uh, 150,000 fans. Uh, they said it was the largest fan attended event. Uh, but, uh, you know, I don't think you could have scripted it any better than the way it turned out. Helio is so popular in Indianapolis. Nobody left the stands until after he completed his victory lap in the pace car and still even then it was probably another 20 minutes or so before people started to vacate the stands that's just how incredibly popular he is there he and he is as genuinely a nice guy as you'll ever meet here we go folks all right so here we go it's like alex said it is sunny death here it's either going to be confederate cat or it's going to be joe here we go all right what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got here? Oh, there. None of them want to come out now. Nope. There we go. There we go. There we go. First one out. Three. Number three. Number three. Number three. Number three. That is Joe. Ruh -roh. All right. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Into the box. Let's dig deep. That's what do we got. The Road Bandit. Road Bandit. Kind of a weird looking car. All right, here we go. Oh man, oh man, oh man. We got three left in here. And let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Right, here we go. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Click, clank, clunk, number four. Number four, number four. Oh, that is Confederate Cap. Oh, now it is sudden death. This is for all the marbles, folks. Case on the line, case on the line. Here we go, here we go. I got to get something else out of the box here. What will it be? What will it be? What will it be? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Score for Cap. Oh my goodness. He got the Mustang funny car. Treasure hunt. Not as good as a super, but hey, it is a tea hunt. Tea hunt. Tea hunt. Tea hunt. All right. This is it. This is it. This is it. There they are. Let's, let's mix them. Let's get them dancing. Let's get them prancing. Let's see what we got here, guys. All right, let's take her back. Who will it be? Is he kicking around here? 
I'm watching the screen, waiting to hear that click. Ah, there we go, there we go, there we go. What do we got, what do we got, what do we got? Number 13. 13, 13, 13. Oh, that is Confederate Captain with his points. Oh my goodness gracious. Joe, looks like you got it, buddy. We'll have to verify. We'll have to verify that. First and foremost here though, let me get, we gotta get Cap something good out of here. We gotta get Cap something good out of the box. Let's see what pulp comes out here as I reach in here, as I dig. What do we got, what do we got? The Audi Avant RS2. All right, so let's verify that last number. Whoops. Verify, 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 verify that it is number 14. 14, 14, 14. Joe, congratulations, sir. All righty, nice, nice, nice. Joe picks up a factory sealed case. I've got it right back here behind me. And here it is, the factory sealed, factory sealed beauty here. H case, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. Man, oh man, if it has that Dotson in there, holy crap, right? Holy crap, holy crap. All right, guys, wow. What a night, what a night, what a night. Hoo wee, ladies and gentlemen. Well, I'm happy to be back. I'm kind of sad at the same time. And I said earlier, whenever I get back home, you know, back to Indiana, I have a very hard time uh, coming back to Florida. Uh, but, uh, you know, uh, there's just I, all my family and everything's up there, you know, and I, I do miss them. And I, I wish I had more time. But when I'm up there, when I'm up there working at Indy, that's where my time is. I have hardly any spare time because most of my time is spent at the track. Um, but, uh, you know, I'll have, I'm, I do have to make time, and I'm going to have to start taking more time. Yeah, because, we, as we, you know, guys, we all know tomorrow is not promised. And, uh, uh, you know, you never know when that last moment will be. So, but uh, anyway, folks, hey, guys, gals, thank you all so much, man. I really appreciate you all coming in here this evening. We had a great night. Uh, my goodness gracious, we, get, we did what? We gave away three cases total in the night, I think. Was it three cases or just, no, oh, we did a case break and we did... We gave away two cases. Great deal there, folks. So guys, gals, everybody have a great night. I understand we're supposed to have some uh, new stuff come in tomorrow. So uh, keep watching for Rick at one o'clock tomorrow. I'll be back at seven o'clock tomorrow night with prime time. Guys, we'll do it all again. So uh, my friends, all of us here at Diecast TV, we love you all. We appreciate you more than you know. So everybody, take care, and we will see you tomorrow right back here with more Diecast TV. Stay tuned. We're going to the stream store now. We'll catch you later. Ross the Boss here for showing you some super Hot Wheels, super sweet. Gotta love it. Check this out. It's a Dodge Challenger drift car in the beauty purple. Take a look. Sweet. It's got the 426 inside. You gotta love that. It's super fast. I'm sure it is. I'll tell you what. If you want to get it for your collection, very simply type in the number 10018 in the comment section below. That's 10018.
Know why the best-selling automobile in the world is a Ford pickup truck? Well, I'll show you. Ford makes some awesome pickup trucks. Look at this 2019 Ford Ranger Raptor. Raptors are awesome, man. Look at this beautiful one. Baby blue. Look at all those uh, checkers on it. My goodness. Look at the knobby wheels. Oh, what a great truck from Hot Wheels Hot Trucks. That's right. New for 2019. Buy it now. Type in the number 60635. 60635. Hot Wheels Gran Turismo. The Real Driving Simulator. Nissan Comset 2020 Vision GT. Hmm. Look at this. You want the card? Just type the number 27041. 27041. Help! I need somebody help! Beatles, baby! Check out the Help album! My goodness, what a gorgeous Corgi! Wow, London double-decker bus! Look at that, look at that! Corgi, help, help, help! From the Beatles, my friends, one of my favorite albums of all time. Wow, you should get this in your collection. If you want it, type in the number 10095. That's right, 10095. All right, my friends, check out this M2 for 18 mags. Put, a little, put on a little class. <laughs> there we go. Check it out, check it out. 1968 Mercury Cougar R code. There we go. Got the chrome grill, split grill. The ET logo in the back. Chrome bumper. Nice looking casting. If you'd like this one, all you have to do, go down in the comments. Type in 10639. One zero six three nine. Okay, and here we have folks from Hot Wheels from the Hot Wheels City Collection. Now, when we have the live auctions, we're always getting asked about Batman. These are very, very popular. Here we have the Batman Live Batmobile. This is a real sharp looking one, actually. It really is. If you'd like this little Batmobile into your collection, just down in the comments, type in one zero five three three. That is one zero five three three. Crimson Crusher, boys. Look at that green light, 1973 Ford F-250. Crimson Crusher. Ha <laughs> ha, look at that beautiful. Crushing the cars, it's awesome. That's an F-250, 1973. Beautiful headlights on that. What a great de attention to detail. Hey, if you like monster trucks, I got to tell you, green light makes the best monster trucks of all. So to pick it up, just get it. Just get it, get it, get it. Go type in the number 10721. That's 10721. Johnny Lightning, Chevy Copa Muscle, Muscle Cars USA. It's all metal on metal. Pretty, pretty awesome. Uh, this is a 1968 Copo Chevy Nova SS. Uh, Johnny Lightning, of course, makes sets of these. So there is a complete set of six cars. And this is the version B, alternate colors. And this is release two. So you can also look in the stream shop. It'll have release one as well. And it's pretty awesome. So if you want to get it, very simply, take the number 10291. Put it in the chat below. And you can claim it for yourself. So there you go. 10291. Another great rig right here from Matchbox. Check out this load lifter. My goodness. Look at this load lifter. DAF skip truck. I love the detail on these rigs, man. These rigs are awesome. These rigs are famous. Matchbox, I think, makes the best rigs of all. And you should grab this too if you love rigs. Item number is 60614. 60614. Oh, some really cool stuff came in from M2 Machines. You gotta love this one. It's the Ford Econoline van, a 1965. Pretty awesome in the blue and the white stripe there. Let's take a close look at this. Now, this is a model kit, which is what's really cool about this. It comes with the old lift. Oh, wait, so you see the lift there. It comes with that. It's got the car, the base. It's got all the wheels. Let's get ready for the track. For track days or just everyday driving and the tools are supplied right there <laughs> you gotta love that take a look at this the detail is amazing if you want to get this one it's a great thing to do i love putting them together They're kind of fun especially if kids and stuff get involved with this stuff get them into it uh it's awesome so if you want to get this very simple just write the number 10260 put that in the chat below and that's yours it's claimed yours so that's 10260 Okay, guys, check it out from Matchbox. We have the Texaco collection. 
Uh, this was one of six. It also has the collected card in the back, the 1921 Ford Model T van. Now, I just want to explain something. There's there's two layers of protective um, plastic. There's an inner and an outer. That's why it's really hard to video these because there is just so much glare going on. But I'm trying to do my best there on the front grill. You get the chrome. Again, you get the card in the back. Metal on metal. There we go. Texaco Petroleum Products. Then we have the six that are on part of this series. Uh, so if you'd like this one, good little bang for the buck on this one. If you'd like this one, just go ahead, type in 10647. 10647. All right, we got a little bit of Hot Wheels in the action. Here we go. Hot Wheels Classic Series 5. Uh, it's very cool. AMC uh, Grease Gremlin, one of my favorite castings. Uh, of course, when I was a kid, I used to play with this one. Uh, the, you know, the one, the orange uh, enamel paint one. It's pretty cool. But this is a, a new version of it. Pretty nice. Uh, this is the chrome. And if I want to point out something up there, take a look at that. It's got the shiny little decal on the top. And that distinguishes for a chase. And the chase ones all have rubber tires, as you can see here. They have rubber wheels, so it's pretty cool. So if you do collect them, this one here, just so you know, the card is pretty clean. It's nice and nice and crisp and clean. That's for sure. Corners are nice. If you want to get this one and you want to collect those ones with the rubber tires, great idea. There's all kinds of them uh, you'll find out there. And this is a good way to start. So if you want to get it, just 10266 is the number. I just put it in the chat below. It's yours. So that's number 10266. Alrighty, folks. Here's another pretty one from M2. We have the 1972 Ford F250 Explorer 4x4. A little different looking than the Explorer SUVs these days, huh? She's metal on metal. She has real rubber tires, real chrome bumpers, and limited edition, one of 8,875 worldwide. If you'd like this one, on its way to you. All you have to do down in the comments, type in 10697. 10697. Ooh, look at this beauty here. 1969 Camaro SS. We have the Goodyear logo on the side door there. This is number three out of five of the Hot Wheel Roadsters series check it out check it out cards in excellent condition look at that beauty you got the stripes going over the trunk down the hood beautiful beautiful casting on this car this one can be yours guys all you have to do is go down in the comments type in one zero four four eight that is one zero four four eight for this 69 camaro ss convertible beautiful beautiful car well, here we go, folks. Another over 20-year-old carded beauty. The cart is in beautiful shape. This is the Osh Gosh Snowplow. On the side there, it says Hannah Plow in Scrape, which fortunately we don't need that down here in Florida, but somewhere in the world right now, in the middle of January, you do. So, if you'd like this one, all you gotta do is type in 10565. 10565. Hey there, folks. Here we have another beautiful design, of course, Hot Wheels Volkswagen. Out of this series, this is number 9 out of 10. There we go. We can see if we can get it up close. It says Hot Wheels Tire Shop on the side there. Uh, these trucks were actually a, a rear engine, so those little, those little slots you have on the side there are actually the slotted cooling vents for the engine. Got a little spear, looks like a little spear tire toolbox in the back. There we go. Check it out, check it out. If you'd like this one, just go ahead, type in 10658. That is 10658. And here we have number four of the series. Again, the entire series is in Stream Store. There is six of them. They are the legendary bad birds of the 50s and 60s. Johnny Lightning. Struck gold once again on these gorgeous cars. Die cast. They are metal on metal. 1958 Ford T-Bird. There we go. The Thunderbird. 1958. This one here is going to be number 10703. 10703. 
How y'all doing? Hey, hey, it's Auto Worlds in the house with the Warner Brothers Scooby Doo. Scooby Dooby Doo. Where are you? This is the Mystery Machine Slot Car Racer. You gotta love that. It's pretty cool stuff from uh, Auto World. We're getting into the slot cars and we're sort of easing our way in. So I got some of the silver screen uh, machines and uh, this is a pretty cool one, I have to admit. Mystery Machine Slot Car is very awesome, especially you want to get into the tracks. Do you keep continuing watching the diecast TV? You'll see we got some giveaways there with track, and it's awesome, and you'll love it. So, if you want to get this one, I don't have, a, I only have a few of these guys. If you want to get one, it's 10196 in the chat, just put it down below, and it's yours. So, that's 10196. Hey there, folks. Krista here. We have M2 in conjunction with Lakewood Industries. That's what that L is on the door. We have metal on metal rubber tires included as another protective case inside there. Here we go. Take a look. Take a look. All right. And this is the 1956 Ford F100. 1956 Ford F100 truck. Cards in beautiful shape. Really, really nice little casting. If you'd like this one, just type in 10540. 10540. Hey there, folks. Krista here. Check this one out. This is the 1998 First Editions Ford Escort Rally. Got tons of little, look at that little the wing up there on the top. Look at the front of this. Cool, cool little casting. If you'd like this one, all you do is go down in the comments, type in 10561. 10561. Matchbox has done it again. I love these Jeeps. They have this Jeep series they put out, and it was it's very cool. This is a 2018 model one, too. I love the old ones. I love the new ones. Great styling on this one. Skyjacker. I love those lift kits. Sweetness on this one. Pretty awesome all the way through. The detail is amazing on these guys. Matchbox always is really superior with detail, and you gotta love it. If you want to get this for your collection and your Jeep collection, you're a Jeep guy like me. I, all you gotta do is take the number one zero one two three, put it down in the chat, and it is yours. So that's one zero one two three. Okay, like I said, I was gonna add some more of the movie and character cars in here a little bit. So of course, this one here is the infamous Cruella Deville from 101 Dalmatians. It's also a 2018 casting, so you also have the little 50th anniversary logo on there. This is out of the Screen Time series, and there you go. There's Cruella Deville's car. Here we go. So if you'd like this one for your collection down in the comments, just go ahead and put in 10532. That is 10532. Hey guys, it's Krista from Diecast TV. Check this one out. This one here has so much going on. We have a green light the from the Hitch and Toe series. The Krispy Kreme Donuts, which is the 1968 Chevy C10. Then with a concession trailer on the back. This even has an adjustable trailer jack with the hitch. Uh, you can see you have the Krispy Kreme um, logos on the hood. And then you have the AC vents and the other vents up on top of the trailer. You even have the little uh, propane tanks there. Check that out. You can see the front of that C10 right there. Let's move this. Then you have that concession trailer. has a little door on the side. And then it even has the little, uh, I guess you'd call it a little serving door in the back for those delicious crispy cream donuts. Making me hungry now. All right. So if you guys want to add this one to your collection, you just go down to the chat section, type in 10367. That is 10367 for this green light limited edition, edition from the Hitch and Toe series. I don't think I showed you the back there. There you go. There's apparently four in this series. This is one of the four. And again, as you can see right there, it says includes the adjustable trailer jack. There we go. So if you'd like this one, just go ahead down in the chat. Number on this very, very Hard to grab limited edition on this one is 10367. You just go type that in 10367. M2s are in the house. Fanta. 
fantastically flavorful. <laughs> you gotta love that. Tastes so good. You gotta like it. It is the Fanta 1969F 100 Ranger truck. You gotta love it. Ford. Beauty. Take a close look. Let's take a look. It's awesome. All the way through. Pretty cool. Drink Fanta. There you go. Pretty cool. The Fanta grape. I remember that when I was a kid. Gotta love it. If you want to get this for your collection, it's pretty cool. We have them in now. They're brand new. And, you know, you see them going around. If you didn't find one in uh, when you're hunting, now's the time to get them. All you have to do is take the number 10202. Put it down in the chat, and it's yours. So that's 10202. Johnny Lightning Topper Series. Replicas of Topper Originals. This is the 1970 Sandstormer Replica. How about that? Die-cast metal body and metal chassis. And man, it is almost just like the original. It's got the paint job of that dark brown with the chrome wheels and the real heavy metal bottom. The motor sits right up back just like the original. If you have a collection of Johnny Lightning, this has got to be part of it. So please type 60692 in the chat. 60692 in the chat. you got to have this Johnny Lightning replica. Hey there, folks. Check this one out from Auto World. We got the muscle wagons. <laughs> this is the uh, Buick 1975 Buick Estate Wagon. Brings back memories of a lot of family road trips uh, like the Griswolds. This one is a uh, limited edition. It does have the rubber tires, the opening hood. Again, it's one of 6,800 made. Very simple if you'd like to add this to your collection. All you do is go and type in 10386. 10386 for this classic 1975 Buick Estate Wagon. And take a look at the front there. You got the uh, single bezel on the headlights there. And they didn't wrap that bumper around. There we go. Okay. Silver Mist Poly also, in case you're wondering about that color. 1975 Buick Estate Wagon. This one is the limited edition. If you'd like this one on the way to you, just go and type in number 10386. Hey guys, it's Krista from Diecast TV. Check out what I have for you today. It is a Hummer H2, the Camouflage Edition. Actually, this one looks like it's, it's a little bit lifted here going on. Probably like an 0405, doesn't have the specific year on here. But here we go. Check out the front. You see what I'm saying on the wheel space on that? It does look like it's lifted on some oversized rubber all the way around. So if you guys would like to add this one to your collection, all you have to do is type in number 10358 in the chat. Again, down in the chat for this Hummer, the Camouflage Edition, just type in 10358. I love these down on the farms. Well, you have to grow, grow up on a farm or be on a farm like I am right now to admire this beautiful 1947 Ford 8N. Wow, look at that gorgeous tractor in red and the white. My goodness gracious. Sit up there and just plow the fields, baby. Down on the farm from Greenlight. You want it now? Type in the number 10715. All you have to do is right there in the chat, type in 10715, and it's yours. And here we have another beauty from M2. This is a very low number limited edition, one of 4,400 pieces. This is the 1965 version, if you will, of the uh, modern day box truck. This is the 1965 Ford Econo line truck. I believe this had the uh, Falcon 144 in it and a six cylinder engine, if I am not mistaken. Here we go. Take a peek, take a peek. Separate display stand inside. 